I'm all done. What's up guys, Cyber Houdini here and welcome back to Judgment. I kicked this off in the first stream and I, I think I played like four straight hours of it. I was dashed into it. It's a Yakuza spin-off game. The best way I can put it is it's like the badassness of Sleeping Dogs mixed with Elena War or Ace, Ace Attorney if you know that series. But damn, I'm enjoying the hell out of it. A lot of names, a lot of badass fighting. Like one minute you'll be chasing down a perp and the next minute... You'll be in a massive fight against five guys throwing motorcycles at each other. It's fucking insane! Beautiful Japanese craziness. Oh yeah, those Sega um, mini games are awesome as well. Jeez, this chair is about to go. I swear to God, I gotta, I gotta fix that shit. Ah, oh, it's still hot as hell here. Hope everyone had a great weekend. Welcome, welcome. Kick faces, yes, yes. Kick faces and punch fart boxes. Wait, what? Ah. Oh. Yeah, so I, I need to go, go um, level up my health and stuff because I, it was a, a boss fight. We're going to finish off the first case in um, in this stream as well. Yeah, uh, similar to the Sinking City, there's like, you know, 12 to 10 huge cases and double the amount of that for side cases. So much fun. Oh yeah, that fucking that drone was awesome. It's a bit more deliberate. Like, uh, Sinking City definitely makes you use your brain more. Whereas this one, um, it's, uh, yeah, you just basically... you. It's more like a, a Japanese sim as well, you know? Hey, Swap B! What's happening, man? Oh, I'm good. I'm doing good. How was the rest of your weekend? God damn, this music is real chill. It is really chill. Alright, let's move on over. That's a hell of a starting screen, right? Yagami is the name of the guy we play. He's a detective. A disgraced detective. You can tell by the fact that he wears a leather jacket. That means he's disgraced. Which one was I on? This one. Why did I make a second save? Oh, it's an auto save. There you go. I knew I didn't make a second save that quick. Whew, it is hotter than a motherfucker. I, I found a way I, I'm out there doing like three or four extension leads, but I put the PS4 outside the room. Bad PS4, you stay outside in the shit that you did. It's too loud. The PS4 is too loud. I cannot stand it. If I can hear it with the earbuds in as well, like I can only imagine what you guys can hear. So look, we'll see if this works. Like, the only other way of doing it is like if you put it in like... um. A unit or something, but those PS4s run hot, and I can't have that, so actually having it in another room might be better. We'll see how this works out. With all the extension needs, the Elgato is probably going to break, but we'll see. I've noticed, like, if you mess with the, their cables, it gets really pissy. So this is our detective agency. It's basically his home. Like, he sleeps on the couch. He's got a pinball machine that I don't know if I can use. You can decorate this place as well. So cool. The combat system is like a freaking, uh, uh, like a Tekken or a fighting game, you know? There's over like 43 or 47 skills that you can get. Here's the boost health. I need to do that. So you get these SP, which just, they're skill points. You get them for doing something as simple as, um, figuring out like an interrogation quickly to spying on someone with a drone. You know how it goes. He's a booty detective. He is. He's really tall as well. Wait, you see him running around as well. Just popped in to say hello. Cheers, gameplay. I appreciate that. Mother of Christ, the heat. It's more hot now because I was trying to sort things out like in the last half hour. All right, everyone looks cool. This chair is definitely going to go. I don't feel any support in it. <laughs> it's gone. All right. It yeah, unlocks a new skill as well. You can find these like posters around with QR codes on them. If you scan them in the game with the phone, uh, you get like new moves and stuff. Look at all this stuff. I wanted to... What was the one that was called? It was like the move. There you go. The flying blow. This is like the flying crane kick. The unblockable move from Karate Kid. I gotta get it. New skill. Alright, we won't stay in the menus too long. It looks like you can always in effect. No, you can't. Can you confirm? I thought you could buy it multiple times. See the way it goes like level one, but there's like three digits in it. No, that's it. Alright. Because uh, I noticed like I was doing a boss fight. And everyone else is fucking doing it. Um, seem to have a mountain of health. Cause you, yeah, there you go. Look how much uh, upgrade of health that gave me. Good lord. So yeah, you can look, listen to records, change your clothes. There's a good bit of undercover stuff. It's cool. Reminds me of Sleeping Dogs. Like, this is the closest thing we're going to get to Sleeping Dogs too. And I was supposed to get stuff in my mailbox, but I didn't. Alright. I think his pants are in his butt crack. Probably. He probably can taste the jeans right now. My five minute break. Nice. Hey, Bernie. How you doing, dude? Sleeping poodles. Yes, sleeping poodle. McDoodle. The golden triangle. Report to Shintani. Alright, so the first case it was called Three Blind Mice. 
and uh, it was your basic Yakuza gang killing but we need to prove who did it as if we can like cut off one head of the of the dragon and just expect that to be it it's supposed to be like a VR game you can play Club Sega has all these mini games that you can play that I played a little bit we'll play some more later like there's Virtual Fighter 5 showdown final showdown there's Puya Puya final fantasy zone fighting vipers that one I remembered here they come but supposedly to do this in all the Yakuza games this is their first kind of spin-off game and it's better for it. These guys want to fight. Let's go. Show them what we got. All right. Whoa, everybody is Jackie Chan in this movie. Hey, that's my moped. Take this bicycle. I don't like it anymore. It's a piece of shit. Let's change fighting styles. All right. Bitch. That's the best you got. Come on. Come on, come on, come on. Pathetic. Get the fuck out of here. All right. Now, I've seen him fight like 15 people at one point, so. Yeah. Right. And no one seems to care that he beats the shit out of people. I love this game! Sorry, missus. Between this and Sink and City, I've got uh, detective games all sewn up. It's crazy. Dynamite! How are you doing, dude? How was your weekend? Getting back into Judgment. There's so many games now. This week as well, we should have a uh, Stranger Things game and uh, Sea of Solitude, which is one I've been waiting for like two years now. You know when you see like an interview with a, a indie dev, and it's just just full of passion. I I can't really I couldn't really get that game out of my mind because of that. It's pity it's with EA. But what are you gonna do? All right, so you build up this meter called the EX meter up the top right uh, left corner. Sorry, got my right and left confused. And you can do badass moves. Um, they usually kind of kicks in a bit uh, better when you have more people to fight. Blocking attacks, dude. Do I look like I need to block? Come on. But it's, it's really cool. It's a really nice taste of Japan, that's for sure. There's even like parkour. There was a tail in mission, God bless us. I hope we never get another one of them. Because it was just as annoying as uh, Assassin's Creed tail in mission. Tail in missions should be dead. Just kill them. I understand that there is a bit of uh, skulking out and. Smile Burger! We love your smile. Gotta keep an eye on now because I've, I've moved the PS4 outside. It's in the naughty spot. Bad PS4. It's way too loud. I, I can have my Xbox right here, like literally on my lap. And you guys wouldn't even know it was there. But the PS4, no matter where I put it, it needs to be heard. And it's not even like the fan noise. Like that's not actually that bad. It's the goddamn um, it's that, uh, electronic whine. There's a little whine. They call it the fucking coil whine or whatever. It's not. It's a big fucking thing anyway. Though. Everyone's an armchair fucking hardware manufacturer, right? <laughs> Everybody is Kong! Yes, I love, and I've been singing that song a good few times. So this is our kind of mentor slash rival detective agency. Uh, as you can see, it's just so compact. Like, got one little receptionist, God bless her, she's kind of shy, but she's probably a kinky little thing. You, you know those shy girls. Take them home and they'll come out in a big fucking bondage outfit. You're like, yes! <laughs> Let's go talk to this guy. Hey, you find anything? Sure did. Morase spilled the beans so the cure you have to like do proper detective work uh, between like looking at CCTV um, identifying the perps interviewing them going to their last you know pl place known place of whatever uh, it's pretty fucking intense but it, it's very kind of in its Japanese this so, there's quick scenes for everything. More was empty at midnight on the third. Where in Secret City, it's like we give you one clue solve the case and I'm like ah! who made a death at the time. Well, that's a hell of like a something fun. as simple as going in, in the second city, it was um, yeah, it's what not that easy. Uh, the guy was in a fight, never and is. he got his shoulder yeah, stabbed, and that's all they told truth. you. I didn't even know there was a hospital uh, in the island story. or on the island, hmm? and there was. And I, I just randomly went there, and I, he was there. More. Three hours after Hamura. So here's this uh, Amour Club Midnight. Amour Club Love. Take a good look at the edge of the screen. Where? Which which side? Yeah, we, we saw, we, that was one of the bosses, the guy in the purple pimp outfit. We don't see any of them go inside, so I thought nothing of it. The but the stories match up. Marase and his guys went to a morgue. Who is the, the victim? And his eyes and ripped out, gouged out, with a spoon, with a spork, with sharp edges. So the camera then headed, so they saw the camera then headed to the back door, yeah, they knew what they were doing. Use that chain hanging out of his hip to choke. Yeah, that would be cool. I think it's attached to his phone. I don't know for sure. You have a little smartphone like GTA. Agreed. I'll set up another visit. Give me a call once you do. But it was one great bit where I was fighting like the first boss, 
and uh, just start fucking kicking ass, using everything in his office all the way down to golf clubs. And then as the cutscene started, everything was back in its perfect place. I had trashed, trashed that office. A poor bastard. Alright, let's go talk to, uh, I don't, I'm not great with the names. I think her name was Suri, Sure. Yagami-san. Yagami. You spoke to Mafio, yes? Huh? Yeah. Oh, it's so quiet ask? now. It's great. Ah. She seemed happy. It had been a while since she last saw you. Oh. It's cool. There's cool. so much uh, different sad, choices that you can do. Sad. Pretty much the case any way you want. You know, they'll all ask, I always ask you, do you want to go in later. guns blazing? Undercover, like we went in as a pizza delivery guy, and then it turned out we had to kind of fake our way in as a, a heater maintenance dude after we busted up the heater. But we still got one of the questions wrong, so they knew that it was like, I talked to him on the phone. See how tall Yagami is? And there's the whole thing where I think they're trying to help out. Um, the Western side of things, you know, where whereas you know Japanese names are written back to front, so you know their last names first. Um, then there's the whole like San, Sin, all this kind of Chan, all this stuff. The 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 mean like when you're talking to someone, they all have different meaning. One means like if it's a woman. One means it's if it's your elder or your mentor. Like they'll say like Yagami Sensei if 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 it's our apprentice and all that kind of stuff. Hotel New Debra. Chill in. Nice. Yeah, it's so hot, right? Knocking over that poor person's bike. What bike? The moped? I don't know if you can pick that up, but I could pick some serious stuff up. Alright, so where do we need to go? Away from the call. So we can kind of mess around while we're waiting on the call. We can get some food, but my health's okay. Uh, what's this golf thing? Let's have a look at this. Can you genuinely play golf? Mini golf? What's this? Underground doctor. And yeah, I want nothing to do with that. Wake up with a set of tits. You want something? Oh no, not in a particular. Then leave me the hell alone. But what's the thing on the screen mean? Wait, what's this? Examine? What is this? We're going down to the sewers? Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles? No, that, that was a little flag for mini golf or something. What is there? What have I found? This is so cool. Is it pretty fast? Oh, there's a whole lot of hobos down here. Who'd want a surgery down here? Wow. It really is an underground doctor. Have you seen the hidden cats? Yeah! No, I, I didn't notice that you can't... You, there's cats walking around normally, but to take the photographs of them, you it's only in the investigation, so it's like pretty much one cat per investigation. That's my office. Y'all like them tight and compact. I don't know. Four or five Japanese guys to one woman? That's a lot of sweat. He's stinking. And then they're all eating like... Ramen and stuff. Oh dear God. Yeah, did you guys get up and good at the weekend? It was cool watching you play uh, Salt and Sanctuary. I need to get that game. I never got to finish it. So many great little 2D, 2.5D, um, tough games like uh, what you call it? I suppose you call them Souls like I don't know. Dead Gambit's getting a whole lot of free stuff as well. That was really good. It's uh, that's kind of very deliberate. And I seen um. A trailer for like two more of those style games, but they all seem to have a little issue where they don't get the roll just right. But Salt and Sanctuary seems to get it right. It has to be instant, it has to be. Can't be going on here with your fucking. Uh, can we go bowling? I don't know how many of these are actually open, you know? It's hard to tell. It's funny, like, not to be mean rant, but it's widely known that Asian people are, you know, shorter in height. And Yagami's over here, easily six foot three or some shit. He's, he's, he can barely fit in the fucking door. That says it's a door. All right, fine. Maybe we just can't go in there yet. It's hard to know which. Uh oh, these bastards want to fight. Street turtles. Ex boost. Misses, get out here! I'm about to whoop some ass. So there's multiple styles later on as well. Let's see. Oh shit! Let's see if I can do something with this guy. Get up, sir. It said no parking, motherfucker. No means no. <laughs> <sighs> Alright. Let's try to keep an eye on the El Elgato. Okay, I'll even use like the HDMI that comes with the Xbox. Which is supposed to be a, a high class one. But uh, you know, the Elgato does not like you change anything. Bye, you Lily. How was your weekend? So, um, 4th of July weekend's coming up for you guys, yeah? Any plans for that? We don't do anything for that. My bicycle! Oh, my bicycle, Bill. Four, two. How do I throw them again? I always forget this. There is, like, if your meter is filled up, you can actually, uh. 
He, be, he should be able to like do. Oh my god, he had 10,000 yen on him! Oh my god! I have barely anything in this game, so that's like awesome. Dude, not with that bicycle. How do we throw them? Ah, that'll do. I think it might be O. I'm still kind of figuring stuff out. Like, the combat goes pretty deep. That's what she said. Wall jump, wall strike. Yes, I know this, but I didn't have my EX meter. And then it says if you're, like, further up. There you go. Now we get to see a beautiful face. Ready so much bullshit when it comes to, like, to um, station. Will do. There's Thanks. so much bullshit when it comes to, like, USBs and HDMIs, right? No, this one's the best one. No, this one's the best one. It's kind of the same bullshit with hard drives and SSDs and all that. We'll see if the next generation consoles have a solid state drives. It's supposed to be... Solid state drives are supposed to be really good for, uh... What are they called? For, like, o your operating system and, and stuff like that. And the UI. You know, I haven't got to do with operating systems. Same with uh, consoles. But when it comes to running games on them, it's not supposed to be that good at all. See, what I do, it's going to lead me to a taxi. I don't really need a taxi. Um, can I just go there? What, what's it called again? Camarocha PD station. Is that not close by? Like, can I just... What's this? It's the club... The only thing I worry about, but I, I think the game has already kind of, all Yakuza games have done this. I was worried that this is the only map, but as far as I can tell, there's multiple maps, multiple areas. And I didn't notice. Not that it's small or anything, there's enough to do. It's just like, if all this crime happens in one place with like, you know, 10 streets, I think you should napalm the whole place. <laughs> I think we lost out on that one, lads. Alright, let's go grab a cab. These guys want to fight first? Yeah. Mrs. get out here! There's bikes flying around the place. Alright, let's try it. This is one of my favorite moves, is to run up against the wall. Oh yeah! They all have names as well, which I feel so bad about. Don't give them names. Call them Tug 1 and Tug 2. Because if you give them names, I'm just going to feel so bad. Come on, bitch. So the, I think the blue one is the crane, yeah, it says it there. That's better for AoEs. And then the red one is the tiger, it's better against one-on-one, -on -one, guys. Let's see, can we do this? You ready? I gotta wait for this closer. Yeah, I should be able to do it like that. Maybe I didn't buy it, did I not purchase it? Wait, hold on. Wall finisher, yeah. Press right before you kick off a wall. Oh, that's not an EX move. It's down here. EX Playground Panic. Look at this, though. Waking Rat. That's cool. Uh, blasting Kick. Knockdown Enemy. Drunken Fist. Yeah, you can get pissed drunk and just start hitting them. I have that one. I wonder why it doesn't work then. There it is. Yes! It wasn't close enough. I stay home and sleep with the 4th of July. I still have a lot to do. Oh. Have you been drawing some, some more this weekend? So we're pretty close to solving this case. We'll see. I'm hopefully trying to start as early as possible, but I was trying to fix stuff, so it's always the way, isn't it? Um. Mura. Yeah. Might be able to play a little bit of something else. I want to get started on Bloodstained. We shall see. Here's this dude, see? When the fuck am I getting out of here? This guy, he was played by another Ask actor, and the other actor got work, involved, remember? he got caught with uh, drugs in real life. And, That's you know, drugs is very, up. very uh, illegal over in Japan, enough to, like, shame your whole December family 3rd, if you're caught even with a fucking joint. PM. So they have to a delay the game a little bit, and comes to a moor to rescue they ended Kuhn. up having to change what he looks like and everything, which is crazy. Not wanting to be seen by the cameras, he goes in through the back. And? Marase said there wasn't a soul in sight. Well, yeah, I'd already hopped over to the See, That's what we need to do. And what did you do with Kume? I already told you I threw him out the back. And before that? Huh? Around 10 o'clock, you kicked everyone The problem is, this guy in the, the white suit, Kume. you know, he, he's a badass. He's, he's part of Yakuza. I have testimony to back that up. 
Why'd you do it though? We shouldn't have this kind of leniency with them. Just fucking lock them all up. But still, you know. Justice is justice and all that I shit. Must have been feeling nostalgic. Who Done a couple of drawings. Oh, nice, nice. Blaster. He's getting evasive. Even pulled I was too drunk to remember card. Yeah. That's so. Did you need to kick everyone out just for that? Uh, I told you I was drunk. Who knows yeah, what yeah. I was thinking? Well, you seem to remember other parts clearly, though. So like what is the stuff you have to do? You said you have a lot to do, apparently. That. For a so-called innocent man with an alibi, your story has an awful Ooh. lot of holes. Oh, yeah. You wouldn't hide something from us, would you? Of course not. Something like... <laughs> dun, 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 dun. And this music. I said I'm not hiding shit. Now get the hell out there and prove my alibi. I was at the sauna all night long. Prove that and I'm in the clear. I need to have a backup plan in case your alibi doesn't pan out. But I can't help you if you're going to hide things from your lawyer. You're suspected of abducting a rival clan member, gouging his eyes out and dumping him in an alleyway. The English voice we'll acting's pretty good, right? That's the key if we can't win this. Has that thought even crossed your mind? Or are all Yakuza just that fearless in the face of a life sentence? Fear has nothing to do with it. But like hell, am I gonna beg you to save me? Then who would you beg? <laughs> None of your business. It's only a matter of time, Hamura. I'll figure out what you're hiding. This Hamura character, like... Uh, Hamura, hey, yeah, he's um, he's a big character. So no matter what happens here, he's gonna be in the game for a good while. You know, we're gonna cross the Yakuza. Again, like the Yakuza games, you are a part of the Yakuza. Um, in this though, we are, we're outside. You know, we're just a detective. Well, I think he was a lawyer at one point. They have these little badges to say that they're lawyers. There's the funniest thing ever. They look like little pins. You know, and he just presents this tiny little thing. I can't even fucking read. Oh, this guy. Yo, Kaito. Sounds like you've been busy. He seems to be a fan favorite. And it's because of, of the shirts. Figures. He's keeping something from us. There might be more to this case yeah. than we thought. So what? You telling me we hit a dead end? Well, you see the or name of a case, the same like in Alan War. It kind of gives you an idea what they're going for. Hence this like being called Tree Blind Mice. Leaving a it sounds like we've been led around, right? We don't have time to scour the city for leads, though. Hey, how much money you got? How much you need? You'll need three ah, shit. Or so. I've got this friend, a local detective on the force. He'll tell you anything for the right price. Anything? Anything. Guy's All an right. informant. You want the dirt only cops have access The thing is, to. like, uh, anything we spend is in our real so money. So, like, I had to go cop. and buy that suit. It was two grand or something. Extra Kuza. Name's Ayabe. He's a regular over Okay. Tender. Really? Yeah. Surprised you never run into him there. It's where everyone... Cool, yeah, I played about five hours of Sinking City and got through the first, uh, big... Well, it was the first two uh, cases. And we went down on that diving suit, which was so fucking cool. So cool. I loved how it worked as well. Alright, head tender. Supposedly, Mrs. told me there's a, a mailbox here somewhere. No, right outside the door, I think. Oh no, it's outside his apartment and stuff shows up there from time to time. I have yet to get anything though. See how much taller he is than... He's like a good like foot above everyone else. Oh, well, maybe not that foot. God damn it. Yeah, the pneumatics of the diving suit in Second City was so fucking cool. A game is funny, like it... Controls like a Bethesda game, you know, and and performs like one too as well. Sorry to say, but it's okay. I mean, it's never ruined the experience right from me. But that whole hospital of floating NPCs was it was a bit special. But I mean, it's a it's a Lovecraft game that might have been on purpose. So let's see what this tender is. The American Cheerful Weather California Root Bar. Yeah, but what is it? Tender. Is it? A, is it? Is it like a happy happy ending? Masseuse place. Second so cities are cool. Yeah. It's different anyway. People want to like like detective games, you know? Because it plays very much like their other games, the uh, um what are they called? The Sherlock Holmes games, you know? Were you not talking to this bitch before? 
Hey. Everyone looks like they're farted. Of course. Yeah, my, yeah that's so cool. I'm a big brother's birthday is 16. Ah, oh, nice. No one. Sure do. Busy, busy, busy. He hasn't been by in a few days, though. Why? Good on you, Fighter. You're uh, you're a good damn. person. I, I can show you one of my drones. Time. Always. I'll have to come back later. All right. It's okay. Why don't you have a drink or two in the meantime? First one's on me. He's gonna. He's gonna fucking. What's all this? <laughs> Just buttering you up. Remember when I mentioned someone who had okay. a job for you? Yeah. What of it? Well, turns out they won't have one for you what? after all. Sorry. Apparently, the client was trying to get back at some Yakuza who sucker punched him. And he wanted me to do what? Not sure. This Doesn't could be. This could either. pertain to the case. Why, did he go all vigilante on him? The Yakuza Not who. Exactly. It sounds like. Yeah, the this is. This is Hamura. Bars for killing a man. This is the same dude. Zaza. Look. Huh? See, look, Wait it can be a bit deliberate. I, I'll Hamura. get there before they do. You know. Surprised. Though now that you mention it, yeah, I something about a host getting so he, smacked. Yeah, in he the got face smacked in the. So this could actually be huge. Yep. Don't think he got hurt too bad though. This Pretty could sure put Yamura at the uh, at the sauna, else right? You can tell me. Sorry. Meaning he has right. an actual alibi for directly after the bar. It doesn't make him completely innocent though. Until we find the time. Might be able to help establish his alibi. Then we went into the sauna. Yeah, I should ask the host. All right, where is this little bitch? Who is he? Man by the name of Seiya. He's a host over at Club Stardust and All right. Kaiji Street. That's there where you I go. look. Yeah, Bernie, I was, I've been watching that uh, Hitch guy a little bit every now and then. He, he bumps into some interesting characters. That's for sure. What? Who else did I find on? on? Which something I found this old actor dude. He used to be in a. Uh, he's he's huge on Twitch. He used to be on MTV. Uh, he had his own show. I don't think I watched much of it though. Andy Mala Man Melanakis Melanakis Milanakis Andy Melanakis. He's one of those kid actor looking dudes, and he got his own show. Um, and he's on Twitch, he's got like 800,000 people. And he just kind of walks around talking about stuff. He looks exactly the same. I think he has like an actual like growth hormone disease. So he's in his 40s, obviously. MTV shows long, long time ago. And um, this would have been... Well, it's not that long ago. Yeah, like 10 years ago. Shit, I... Well, then that's probably why I didn't see it. Yeah, it's only 10 years ago. Shit, I thought it would have been way... There you go. So yeah, he was like walking around... Um, Venice Beach, and he started to mess around with some Uber drivers pretending to do real life GTA roleplay, which is it was actually fucking hilarious. Kept talking about meeting up with um Trevor and all this kind of stuff. But yeah, I seen him once. Yeah, yeah, like I, I um, there's a couple of other guys that do kind of stream and travel and stuff, but they're really obnoxious. There's one guy really fucking obnoxious, and like if people don't talk to him on the street. Even if they don't speak English, he just like shits on them on the stream. That's why that dude, that hitch guy, the Trevor, I know it's just maybe it's because he's Canadian or whatever, but he's seems like a normal dude, you know what I mean? Very little bullshit involved. Hence why people pick him up and and talk to him. Pub Trinity. This must be Stardust. Can, uh, please don't make me pay to get in here. Let's see, we're gonna have to talk this this is probably not the same host. Camurocho. Hey, Camurocho? I don't know, is that even in... Depends. It's probably a what do you fake need? place. Camurocho. I'm looking for someone who works here. Think I could talk to Seiya for a sec? Seiya-san, huh? Is it in no, Tokyo? Can't do. It is Tokyo. Not today. Interesting. Is he off today? It's a red light district. Not quite. He's out on a date with a customer. In Shinjuku. He could be practically anywhere then. It's so crazy when people think Third of... In a row, too. He's got it wrapped around his when finger. When people think of... Yeah, that's uh, great. Tokyo, you just think of back. Tokyo, right? No clue. But even like, there's so many little different far, uh, provinces and All right, cool. little parts. You exactly. know, it's similar to a big city, one of your guys' big city, where you got like Koreatown and all this kind of stuff. You know, we don't have cities big enough to have different districts like that. <laughs> we don't. We don't. All right. Hello. It's funny you can't move. Yo, oh, this super. guy. He's he's basically our Q to our James Bond. I, uh, he's our tech guy. I you couldn't some. tell by the Google Did Glass. Do man. Search for me? Sure. You mean yeah. Ice Poseidon? Is that is that a town? Let's go with Stardust and I Seiya. sent it. 
Oh, and let's limit the search history to I just today. I want to do Dead by Daylight roleplay. That'd be cool. I mean, you play it enough. It makes sense for like it's working. It's working. for you, you know. <laughs> Seen someone do it. Yeah. Like, but it makes the game more. Oh, cool. oh yeah, in the game. Yeah, why not? Other keywords you want to narrow this down by? Hmm. Oh yeah, we gotta do it. This bit's a bit tough. Um. All right, give me a second. Oh, that's very cool. Damn. God, the quality of your drones is going up so much. What does it say on your little, on your little top? Yeet something. Let me see. Yeet for life. Oh, wow, the hair is so cool. How do you do that? Is it like a different brush or something? You know, and we got the little Japanese mask on. I wonder can people see that? Yeah, you can. Wow, no glare. See that? Why well, is awesome? That saves me opening Discord actually, because uh, my resources get out of control very quickly. All right, you're getting better. He's an IRL streamer as well. Oh, cool. All right. Is he is he obnoxious? No, this guy I think he's called like J Streezy. I shouldn't even call him out, but I'm not against him. I don't know the dude, but uh, for that one half an hour I watched him, he he was pissing off a whole lot of Croatian people for no reason. You know, I was like, what the fuck is wrong with you, dude? If they don't want to talk, you're on camera. That's their own fucking choice. Don't bad fucking bad mouth them in front of people. Jesus Christ. Anyway. It's a, a surefire way to get your ass kicked, let me tell you that one. Much. Food, so like we need to find we need to find this guy, so let me see. Doesn't really matter which one I pick, I don't think. Which one's we Yeah. Let's start with the date. Oh, that yep. did the trick. Great. Should be easy to check. Now we've only got myself. three messages. Thanks, Boom, Simo. just like that. I'm sure you'll find your pretty boy in no time. Time to get out the Oh! Okay, you're gonna make me choose. Look, that's so cool. Look at the billboards. I know it's just a stinking billboard, but the quality. This really is like. It says red light district. I think red light district means different things for different people. For me, we all know what I know what red light district means. Like, I'm talking like. I'm talking Amsterdam fucking window dances. It's so cool. And that Trevor guy was in Shibuya, which everyone knows for the famous Shibuya crossing. Don't make me go to another taxi. No, we're coming up here. Cool. All right, see if we can find this guy. I'm assuming we're looking for a guy with like a. Uh, looking for a woman. She would have a little thing up over her head, like it's not just gonna be random NPC number two. Yeah, this might be hard. She's got a little thing. Hello. Hello. Excuse me, man. What is it? I'm looking for a host named Seiya. Works at Stardust. Wait, you know Seiya kun? Is he alright? Mom, we got our first we go. We're gonna go on a date tonight, but he never showed. I'm kinda worried. Bitch! Hey, Queenie! Uh, How I'd was your weekend? I was on a date around here, too, but I guess that means it wasn't with you. Uh, that is fucking better awesome. Luck next yeah. Time? Wait, what? Why did he get, keeps getting better and better with girl? every drawing? Sounds like it, but don't take it too hard. I'm that's sure the, that's the back. one thing you can do, right? Oh, thank goodness he's safe. You see your improvement. I thought he'd gotten into an accident or something. All you guys are the same. I Queenie's like back in her day. element with streaming now. And Dynamite, you get better and better. You add something new to your streams every time. Uh, I'm gonna invite Queen to a Dead by Daylight. Role play. Not in a weird way. Is that? It's just, that's okay. It's obviously not the same person. Let's keep going. I, I'm a whore for like I'll talk over people in the game. Cause usually, like when that happens, you have a chance just to check up and chat, but it's probably not the best time to do it. It's the best way of getting through here. You can go underground and everything. This place is huge. But probably just a car park. <laughs> it fucking is too. <laughs> this place is huge, man. I love Japan, dude. This is a parking lot. Get the fuck out of here. <laughs> I love Japan. Eating ramen in a parking lot. This is Japan. You're definitely tourists, aren't you? How could you tell? Because you're excited by a parking lot, you stupid fool, man. Excuse me, ma'am. What? I'm looking for a host named Seiya. Works at Stardust. Huh? What do you want with Seiya? Uh, very drunk I need to and ask him very hungover. I heard he was oh, on a date shit. Here. Did you say date? Who's the bitch he's cheating on me with? Oh, uh, you know what? Never mind. It's fine. It is not fine. What the hell is going on? Well oh, done, Yagami. Uh, look at the time. Well, if he's a two-timing bitch, 
Fuck him. There's no like sales here. Yeah, you got it. You got him in trouble. Sounds like you needed that, Queenie. I night out with the girls. You know, all these billboards are so cool. Then you actually like translate them, and turns out to be like hemorrhoids or something. Cream, hemorrhoid cream. Xperia. Jesus, how far have Sony fallen? We used to make phones. Now we make hemorrhoid cream. Do you dread sitting down? Who wants to fight? Bring it! This dude, he thinks he's, he thinks he's Bruce Lee. I, li I like this block he does. That's like a real block. You keep your arm close to your face so you can control the power of the block. Who wants on? Switch over to Tiger. Tiger style. Hiya! Now I'm going to finish you with green cone. Take my cone. I can't believe I got 10k uh, for that one bit. Alright, let's go find this woman. See, this is the bit. I think I found her first, but they want me to check out all three. Cyberspace. Yeah, when I took a dra Yeah, I know. <laughs> Whoopsie! <laughs> That's good. I almost spat out my drink. I almost... I almost drowned in my own drink. No one makes me drown in my own drink. Damn, that dude ain't fucking playing around. Oh yeah! Finish him off. Now it's just me and you. Hold on, this guy wants to... Whoa! My scooter! It flies! Damn, Japan is so fast forward in technology. That scooter than flu. Flying mopeds, I'll take two. One for each bowel. Hey, come on now, man. Alright, anybody got three dots above their head? How you doing, girl? Ooh, girl. You guys want something in the shop? Who wants some peeps? I get some peeps. Oh, here's some nice hair. Who wants a nice hair? Oh, damn. What's all this? Oh, we got like Sailor Moon stuff. Oh, Jesus. Skirts. Oh, Lord. What the fuck is this? Is this a man? Sir, you're looking at a door. Who wants some toilet paper? I know that ramen can go down very bad. The ramen's coming back up. No, I don't see anyone to talk to. No, maybe because of that fight, she might have run off. Damn it. Where she is? Damn, girl, you hide well. I hope they can get your soon. That's the one she's going on the day from. Wait a sec. You mean? You think we'll get our Saints Row fight? I think so. Yeah, I think so. If it, if it's still THQ Nordic, the they're doing like crazy uh, numbers right now. No, sorry. Rip the scooter. I'll buy a hat for you. Oh. Yeah, that's where he is. But it looks like you know as much as I do. Um, hey. it was needed. My feet are crying hey. agony, though. Oh. Ah, from, from dancing. I'm sure he's just taking his time getting dancing. ready. What's what's um? He'll be here any minute. What's it like Welsh uh -huh. nightlife like? Pretty much How same as England, yeah. Anyway? You just dance around your handbags? No. <laughs> I shouldn't have asked. You walk Excuse into a club with a few drinks on you, and try to pick up a girl, and honest to God. It's like, it turns into like David Attenborough's. Damn, I got nothing. It's like the the females flock together in a strange mating ritual around their handbags. Oh, here comes one very very Irish male. He's approaching the females. Oh, oh no, he tripped over his own foot and headbutted one of them. Nah. Oh, this is the worst thing that could have happened. <laughs> That's the kind of shit. I bet there have been more posts since earlier. Doubt that's gonna change. This guy like lives sure, in. He's our tech Let's guy. He lives in an internet <laughs> cafe. Like he's got a sleeping bag in Everton. Booty call. The landscape of social and girl, does he connected. look delicious? What? This is like Tinder. We found the Tinder. Japan's Tinder. Booty call, my. All right, I'll check mayday, it out. Mayday. Thanks for everything, Tsukumo. <laughs> Not a problem. <laughs> Oh, have you tried dancing with heels? <laughs> no. <laughs> no? Why are you asking me this? Who have you talked to? <laughs> Fuck off, my bag was left in the boot. Yeah, right, no, this is something I always notice. Because, I mean, who holds the handbags? Yeah. So always just make me laugh. It was, there was a thing for a while. Probably don't do it anymore. Oh, me with my purse and my phone? Yeah. That's where the bra comes in, right? My god, you girls can fit, like, four-story apartment in your bra. Bye now. You just kind of jump into your own. I don't know. Kind of weird. 
don't know what I'm talking about. Yeah, I like the. I know the boss fight's kind of funny because it's just a, uh, another dude, but my god, did it start pulling out knives and shit? You can get mortal wounds in this, and uh, they can only be healed by medical kits, which are pretty hard to find, or possibly that underground doctor in the sewers. And um, it's up to you. you don't give up, do you? Sorry. Sorry, lads. Sorry, sorry. Let this car pass, then I'm gonna whoop that ass. First, I let the car pass, then I whoop that ass. Fuck your bicycle, man! There's nine million bicycles in Beijing, and I'm about to whoop you with all nine million of them. That's right. Oh man, I'm getting so much money just for fucking around here. It's great. Alright, you can pass now. I think he's scared stiff. What are you beeping at? This guy is trying to do like. The, oh, he disappeared. Don't you love when that happens? No one will ever know that I just committed triple murder. No one will ever know. And this guy's a detective as well, so he just covers up his own tracks. It's awesome. We're going this way? No, I think I still need to go up. It's a little hard to tell. There's so many little places to jump into in the um, in the map. <clears throat> Here we go. Which guy do you think it is? Oh, he's probably on a date. Is it this guy in the suit? Man, I swear K-pop has hey, kind of ruined everything over there. Man. Women look more like men. Huh? Sorry to butt in. You have a sec? I don't know how a woman could find that kind of effeminate style very me, attractive. Friend. I don't know. Maybe that's I just my be. weird way of thinking. Hey, is everything okay? Don't worry. It'll all be fine. Look at this dude. Mind stepping outside? The other me some? Wait. You know who I am? I do. But I think I'm getting dragged back out this side. Yeah, yeah, you love it. Just wear comfortable shoes this time. Fuck it. Have fun. Screw everything, Queenie. You needed that. The owner over at Tender told me about you. Thought I'd ask you to do me Six a favor. Six pictures. Damn. You Welsh women can put their drink away. You, Two right? fish bowls? Yes. My god, I haven't had a fish bowl in Said years. You might be able to manage something. Yeah, exactly. A disgraced ex-lawyer who's not afraid to get his hands a little dirty. Sounds like you're pretty well known in Camarocho. Camarocho. So that's what people say about me? One more thing. This is just a rumor, but uh, I hear you'll do anything. I like the for whole the drone stuff was really cool. Got a really the simple car, right? but clever, you know, I can't wait. It's like you need to move around and take a picture. Oh, I wonder how I much fan service would be in the game. Wrong. Fan service is a thing that anime yeah, and right. Japanese um, anyway, style games and movies and all you. that use basically That's to right. get women in when skimpy outfits and schoolgirl outfits and stuff. They call it fan service. We know what it was. Sure? We know what it was. Yes. Funny enough. Dress clung to every to inch of me. God damn. Oh, kept rising as you walk. Yeah. Always makes me smile. I always get a little smile That's when I see women doing that every now and then. Be like they'll stop and just kind of skirt down their dress, and I'm always like, "You're looking good, girl. You're looking good." It just makes me laugh. Because I'm like, no you knew you're gonna be doing that all night, but you still wore that dress, and I can get down with that shit. All right. This guy doesn't look like he what got punched, all right. I think around midnight, out in front of Kyushu Number One Star, not the busiest okay. place. Kyushu Number One Star, isn't that near Sonic Ten? Yeah. I'm getting closer. Mind telling me more? Why did he hit you in the first place? <laughs> Wish I knew. The guy reeked of booze. Well, you don't look like you were just hit, dude. I was just walking down the street when I noticed mm. him coming towards me. Maybe. He is beaten like because there's an unconscious body laying on there. Exactly. Maybe that's it. Doing the, the doggy paddle or whatever the hell that was. Just ah. towards me anyway. Maybe it'll be now cooler in this room without that PS4 going just 90. Left a fucking nasty bruise though. Not one of my I don't see a bruise, dude. Too. A filling, huh? Did you Why would you ask dentist? him did he go to the dentist? Huh? Yeah, Who cares? Stay. Then you'll be in their records. Oh my god, I'm not going to the dentist. I don't give a shit. Ah, so that's what you were getting at. Moving on, what did Hamura do after he hit you? He stumbled See, the away problem with these kind of cases is it really does come down to he said, she said. So she, just to she recap, said, why did she he hit you around 12 she and shot. then headed into Sonic 10? Yes. Oh my lord. Alright, the old guy Sonic 10 said no one left the place until morning. And as long as I can prove Hamura was yeah. here, we'll have our alibi. Oh yeah, the cops mentioned something kind of similar. Can I count on your testimony in court? There's supposed to be a whole like um, no gang of burglars nice and stuff, and they all wear these kind of masks, the like favor. the um, or the Katsune masks, Katsune masks, the like two? foxes. <laughs> and sure. there was I'll one guy you. with a gay fox mask, <laughs> which is very unusual. Hey, one more thing. 
Did you see any security cameras around when you ran into Hamura? Video evidence would lock this up for me. Hmm. Couldn't say. I don't usually look for that stuff. Right. She and heels on a deathly well, stare at anyway. them. I'll be in touch. Of course. See ya. I don't think I can walk in heels. You remind me of like Eleven from Stranger Things. Like, I don't want to go with the norms. Leave me alone. No dresses. I'm, I'm excited to see what to do with um, Stranger Things. They had a premiere for it, which is always weird for a, a Netflix show, but whatever. You do what you want. And um, I know a lot of people got to see the first episode really early. It's cool. It's all based around summer and stuff. 80s. Summer. Summer in the 80s. Like, come on. That is every fucking 80s movie, right? See. The success of Stranger Things has, like, reinvigorated... Oh, careful. Um, the whole, like, you know, kid gang Hello? kind of Yo, uh, movies so from the 80s. Here. You know, like, Negative. Goonies and but Stand By Me and so someone who had a runner with so that, yeah. A lot of movies are going that direction. You've got His Ista came back, you know. Very famous for that. Um, and they're, they're, re David they're doing another Goonies. Uh, Ghost, new Hummer. Ghostbusters movie is going to follow a similar, you know, young four young Ghostbusters. If they have a security camera, it would have caught Not the same everything. ghost, like, I'm heading to style. check it out now. Hold on. Just wants to not have a weird ghost on. app or something. Like these fucking ghost hunters know what it is. If I was worried about getting seen, I'd never leave the office. Huh. Fair enough. Yeah, my feet are killing me and Jordy's bruised on. No. Pulling it down most night. Pulling it up, because, yeah. <laughs> you couldn't win either way, right? You couldn't win. But it's it is fucking cool though, right? It's so hard to um pick a, like a, a game that you're not used to and wonder will it will it work out? Because even I was like, geez, do two detective games, you know? I, but I will try and maybe try and focus on two of them because otherwise I just forget what I'm doing in the middle of a case, and we can't have that. It's where yeah, this is right there. Okay, let's find this. So this these are the investigations, and this is where you can find like a hidden cast every time you'll hear. A little meow. I had missed the very first one. I thought you just found a cat everywhere, you know, like a normal collectible. But it's only in these investigations. So keep an eye out for the cat. You'll hear it, meow. We are looking for a security camera. But if I find that first, it'll cancel out the investigation, which happened already. So just keep an eye out for kitty. It could be anywhere. It could be in a window. It could be anywhere. It's shite, man. I mi completely missed him. Cool, just a cool little. There, I can hear one. Can I see it? Maybe he's inside here. Hmm. Can I move this? Kitty, are you in here? Oh. Where are you, kitty? Are you here? But then I see. The little cat. Little cat, where are you, little cat? <sighs> little cat, where are you, little cat? I bet you. I don't know if you can go beyond the search area, though. <laughs> there you are, hello, kitty. Kitty, kitty! Nice kitty! Some cats have complained that I pet them too hard. I'm sorry. Lovely kitty! Small kitty! <laughs> I always pet them backwards too. Alright, so let's find that security camera. Uh huh? <clears throat> what the? Suspicious. Corner is um, punched him near the cruiser number one star. Okay, how I can't read. Kitty, Kitty, here's the security camera! Kitty! Nice Kitty, I love you, Kitty. Please be my friend! Why are you clawing me, Kitty? Hmm. That's my eyeball, ouchie! <laughs> this is where it is to get a pair of chunky ones. I don't think she even wants to do that kind of stuff. It's all good. All right, let's let's grab this. Nothing else we can find here anyway. That's a nice little touch. That cat won't be there once I finish this. There is a camera. Okay, 
Now we have to find a way of hacking into it. Let me stop investigation. How are we going to find the footage? Who would have that footage? It wouldn't be the same place. It's across the freaking road. Looks like it's functional. We shall see. Hey, you! Uh oh. Is that the same purple suit guy? I know you. I whooped boy. you once already! Marase. What a coincidence. Was. was it, oh, no, this is what I'm talking about! Are they rifle gangs? Clear your schedule, because I'm going to take my. God damn! You. Boys! Get this fucker back to the office! Holy shit! Really don't have There's like 15 dudes! You talk! You talk. Yeah, Kaido! Let's go! Let's go, let's go, let's go! Where are you? <laughs> he just fucking drop kicks three dudes! This dude! Complete redemption for that shirt! sweet, man! I told you, this just. It goes from 0 to 11 like nothing! Alright! You two fuckers are going down Hey, stop calling me fucker, man. You don't know my life. I am a fucker. Let's go! Oh my god, he's got a katana. He's not fucking around. I'ma shave that head, man. I'm shit. Look at that. I'm gonna shave that. Alright. Akira, boy. Is this not the same guy we fought? No, maybe not. I'll have to figure it out. Let's begin! Yeah, he's got a he's got a whole like boss thing. Let's take care of his minions. We got Kaido san helping us out. Whoa, he just took like a lump on me. Let's get rid of the little peons and minions and stuff. EX boost time! Woo! Everybody thinks they're fucking cool. Ain't got ninja skills like me. Oh man, I don't know if you can block that. Oh, I cannot move! Wow, that really fucked me up. I'm pissed. Jesus, I cannot get away from Crazy Katana. He even hits his own dudes. And you can dodge a little bit of it. It's more like dodging that particular move. Moreover than... Alright, Kaido-san, let's fucking go. He's done. Alright, now it's just me and you. See, you can dodge it like that, but it's, you know, well-timed, of course, it's awesome, but, oh man, does it hurt when you, you don't get it right. Let's switch over to Tiger Style. It's better for one-on-one. -on -one. Alright, that guy's dead. Let me grab this. Kaido, watch out. Booya! You got in the way, dude! My magic bike skills. Oh my god, I cannot fucking get a chance at this guy. Where's my katana? I know what we can do. Jesus, I'm in trouble here. Oh my god! Let's go for it. Oh, bastard. No, up! Run up! There it is. Oh, man. Oh, yeah, yeah! Shit, Kaido is nearly hit as well. Yes! But now he's going, like, second phase. I think I need to buy some, like, vending machine ramen or something. Damn! Uh-oh, QP time. Look at this, though. Break that blade, dude. Break it. Oh! Close shave. Now he gets to go into XP boost mode, but so do I. <laughs> Kato! Oh, that's gotta be a broken back. It's gotta be. And a finish by Yagami! Sit the fuck down, boy. Nice team up, lads. That was badass as hell. Hard to. No, I can't move. There's gotta be a way of snapping out of that. Kinda stuck there. Taking all the shits. Kato was in a bad way. Damn, he blocked that badass move! Shit, I'm gonna die here, hold on. Is there a way? Oh, there's a mallet there. Is there a way for me? What's this medical kit? Mmm, small health recovery. Any, like, proper food or anything? Oh, damn. No disguise required. Alright, let's use that. Let's pick up this mallet. Now you're gonna fucking die! 
Oh yeah! Block this, you son of a bitch! That didn't even do that much damage. He knocked it out of my hand as well. See, he's got that flame stuff on. That's his XE boost. I don't get any of that fancy stuff. Damn, how do you like time that stuff? Or it actually hits me. The wall run and stuff it never seems to connect right. Oh shit, he's doing it. Get out of there! Watch out! What? I got mortally hit for that. Damn it! Maybe you just have to be on the same wall? I don't know. I never hit the son of a bitch, see? All these awesome moves, but not more. Why am I always falling on the fucking ground? Oh yes! What a combination! See, you just- Look at that! That's a fucking five hit! Jesus Christ! Let me get that. Let me get that fucking sledgehammer, boy! Ah, I need to figure out. It must be a move to stop you falling on the ground as much. Because then you have to just slam on the X button. You're just kind of waiting there for the animation to stop. Oh. Please tell me you found something. Ba -ba -ba. You I thought did, I fought this right? guy inside with these purple. I suit. think I did. Check out that camera. <sighs> We're nice to team up with Kato. He's pretty badass. This chair breaks during and the stream. If it doesn't, Rest in peace, me. Let's let's try and stay optimistic. Well, camera, you got good news for us or what? He's not gonna answer back. I swear. I've been talking to cameras all my life. <laughs> yeah. Let me see. I think there was something about doing a move if you fall to the ground. This video shows everything. There we go. Right? So the guy in white is Yamura. My client. Hamura-san drunkenly attacked this passerby on the Yeah, he did the too. Then, after the altercation, oh Christ, we're going straight to trial. Look at this. I watched Hamura-san walk into Sana Goten. The courthouse, man, we're going straight to the trial. Yagami's there. Yagami everybody's there. The Who's this that, dude? Until the train started in the morning, meaning the defendant was accounted for during the hours in question. The defense asserts that this video establishes a clear alibi, which can only be seen as proof of Hamura-san's innocence. To that end, I have a question for the prosecution. Did you have any prior knowledge of this video before the trial began? I assure you that we reviewed all the relevant footage from the sauna, and yet the defendant was nowhere to be found. What? At least so I was told. Meaning, you never actually went to examine the site personally then. Would you say that's correct? Yes. My associates took well, care of Well then you fucked up. Nonetheless, the defense's video is far too blurry to... He's wearing the same goddamn the suit! Participant. There's no way to tell whether the man in the footage was the defendant or just a random... Boom! <laughs> Thank you very much. In that case, the defense would like to call a witness to oh. the stand. Oh. This is where we bring out the... Yeah, this is the dude. This is the dude who got punched. Look at him, he seems all sad now. Oh, You were on, you were on three dates two minutes ago. Uh-oh. No! He's been bought off. He's been bought off! He's gonna lie. Say a song. Do you claim you're the person in this video? He's gonna. That someone. He's gonna lie. You that night. Llama fingers, of course. Is that accurate? Nothing but llamas. Don't you lie. Yes. Nice. It is. Now tell us, this person who assaulted you, are they here? Rester, how you in doing? The Witness? Is there a problem? I, um... Hmm? I must have... Uh, been mistaken. You little bitch. I am the one getting hit in the video. But as to who the other guy was... I can't say. 
You little bitch. Why would he just say that was to me in the video? Why did he go this far? Excuse me, Your Honor. Uh, recess, if you Objection! Don't. Objection, Your Honor! Prenuptial agreement. This is basically Liar Liar Japanese style. Yes. That's the one movie that will not take what off Netflix. Happened? Everywhere I go. We recommend Liar Liar. Bitch, I have it on DVD! I, I, I can't do it. I know that movie so back sorry. to front and front to back. But why? Jennifer Tilly! Jennifer Tilly is in Liar Liar. She's the crazy mother with I the big old titties. I don't like her with the short hair, but my god, she's got a rocking body. Go on. But no Jennifer Tilly, yeah. Well, where are we? We could have a Japanese Jennifer Tilly. There was a strange man on the line. He said his name was... Murase. Told me you know him, yagami -san. Yeah? Murase. And he told you not to testify? Yes. He said if I did... If I did... I'd never see my sister again. Dude, you're dealing with Yakuza. What are you doing, Yagami? Calling the police? Kaito-san, it's me. Those KJ art guys took a Fuck, sister. and we just beat the shit out of them. I'm heading over there now. Hell Who's yeah. Hand? See, this is where we can kind of skirt around the law. What the hell are you doing? We're in the middle of a trial. Yeah, but he's not a lawyer. A trial doesn't mean shit if you can't protect Hell yes. Yeah. <laughs> he just shot himself. Get this man a baby wipe, cause I'll he's fucked up. Back. See, we are just a private detective. We ain't no goddamn lawyer. We can skirt out. around the law and whoop everybody's ass and just walk away. Very nice. Very nice. This is what I like. I fucking hate courtroom drama where everyone was like, oh, I suppose that wasn't the right condom after all. Oh, shucks. Over to you, Judge Judy. Your mama's a bitch! Your grandmama's a bitch! Okay, Judge Judy, calm down. So I just get lost. That's why I love Judge Judy. I just get lost in those episodes. I can't remember what the what the fucking case was about, but Judge Judy just ripped a new asshole into that man. God bless. God bless her. She'll like she'll go back all the way down when you were a kid and she's like, nobody ever loved you. She hit you in the deep spot. Things that you wouldn't even know yourself. Alright, we got new information. God bless you, Judge Judy. Mortal wounds. This is what they're talking about. That kind of cracked red bar is literally like a stab wound. Yeah, maximum health. So I got hit a little bit. Very tiny. When the going gets tough. Yeah, I know all this. Okay. Thank you for the host, Rester. I'm good. How's you? I'm good. It's hot as hell here. Um, there's all sorts of shit happening. I'm trying to get, like, book a vacation. Um, my fucking father has gone into hospital again, but he keeps going in and out. Like, he gets these... Chronic infections, and they don't know what it is. One minute they think it's angina, and the next minute it's this. I don't know. Drives me nuts. The hospitals here are, are very, very bad. Hey guys, I got an advertisement for a masseuse with a happy ending. And if you don't go, I'll beat you with the samples. There's your happy ending, mother trucker. Oh, he's getting angry now. You know what that means. First, we're gonna kick his ass, then we're gonna present him with a cone, and we're gonna shove it on his face. Oh, is this a little like. Dog grooming place? Oh no, it's one of the claw machines. We gotta go in there. Yeah, we need those Jennifer Tillies, right? Jennifer Tillies. One Tilly, two Tillies. Tilly! That's why. That's another reason why I don't like the new Child's Play. It's just not the same. And like, they'll obviously, they're gonna try and probably get a sequel out of the new Child's Play, right? Because they can't help themselves. Hence why they just call it the Child's Play. And it's gonna be even further shit. And this, it's just like, bad idea for... Um, <clears throat> Mark Hamill to get attached to a project. Yo, it's Kaito. I'm here. Where are you? A little bit of slowdown when we answer the phone, but it's okay. It's not. It doesn't seem to affect the performance of the game. It's just in the load and the call. Is Europe on fire? Yeah, dude. We're not. We're not getting. We're, we're getting like the outside of it. France is like France reached 45 degrees or something. The hottest on record. I told you guys this was gonna happen. Like blah blah blah. Hottest day since 1970s. But uh, we ours we got up to. I think we got up to like. 30, 32 maybe? Uh, let me see what it is right now. It's it's not too hot, but just the added being in a room with a console and stuff. Um, it's pretty rough. But yeah. See, look, it only says it's 17 here. But it doesn't feel 17. It feels like 27. Because well, you're in the microwave. 27. Whatever. Positive advice for your papa. I appreciate that. They don't know what... One minute they're saying it's just a strain. And then they're like, oh, maybe it's on giant. If you don't harm from to get, like, stents and stuff. Like, me growing up, I always thought stents were very bad. But it's like a weird, like, uh, 
meshy thing they put into the arteries to open them up. It's basically just from cholesterol and all that, you know? Very common in men, heart disease and stuff. But uh, you just be over and it kind of takes him out of action for a while. But he's a devil, he just can't stop. You know, one minute he's on top of a roof and the next day he's fucking uh, trimming hedges and shit. Like, he just can't stop himself. I hope we're not playing Mahjong. I mean, meet up with Kato. Is he in here? I've come into this place like twice and it's still the wrong place. So I'm talking about there's so many doors. I wouldn't know Japan that well. It says it's here, but I bet you it's not the right place. Where are you, Kaido? Kaido san. No, I, I bet you I know where he is. Is it really gonna make me climb this fucking ladder again? No. Weird. Even your dog, this bitch. Bitch dog. Jennifer Tilly. That's it, yeah, Jennifer Tilly. A little. A giant Tilly. There he is. This is his favorite rooftop. Sorry, bro. Fuffer, how you doing, dude? Got any how was your weekend, ideas? man? Well, we can't just barge in. Who knows how many of them are in there? No way I'm getting. Hopefully, away um, you have a great uh, 4th of July weekend yes, coming up. Can. Actually, That's are you guys going to get any time off for that? I know the 4th is like Thursday. We just get the yeah, Friday off, maybe. I don't know. First, I'll make a big scene out for The day after is always like then a hangover. distracted, over you sneak in and get the girl. That's your big plan? Pretty good, huh? Uh, sure. How are you gonna do it? You'll see soon enough. Just remember, both our asses are I don't. here. It's hard to take him serious with that uh, shirt. It literally so, looks like Christmas wrapping yeah. paper from the 1970s. But <laughs> right. well, he's a badass. He just drop kicked in. three guys. You know a flying, a flying drop kick. Thank you, please. My God. Looks like we might be going back to Drone City, maybe. No, it's gonna cause a distraction. <laughs> Trash the place. Now that's art. What the fuck? I read the plot, and they're hey, definitely hitting on sequel. Yeah, they can't help themselves. Name's Kaito, ex Matsugane. Yeah, it seems like we might have been part of the Matsugane family clan. I don't know if they were genuine Yakuza. I wonder what Tak means. I must figure that out. Might just mean like, go man. In Saudi Arabia, or yeah, it got so hot the trees were self-igniting. Wow. That's like that's like a pop apocalyptic shit, isn't it? The very trees themselves. Like I've definitely seen like roads melting and you could smell the tar in the air, which I kinda like, but you know, it's not good. I had my fourth this weekend. Ah cool. We did fireworks and everything. Nice. In your hometown? Ah oh, sweet props. That's why you were kinda you were kinda gone for a bit. Nice. I hope it was great, dude. Damn, that sounds fucking awesome. You got to go home, rescue the sister. Okay, so they're holding um, the witness's sister. Oh, we gotta do a little bit of lockpicking. Alright, let me see. I'm not so bad at this. It's kind of like uh, old old Almost oblivion lockpicking. I suppose Skyrim had it similar. So you have to get it in the really yellow, but I mean, super sensitive, dude. Nice. Oh, you do get a little point for getting it right. Okay, but if you fuck it up, they all get fucked up. Oh, oh Jesus, what was that at the end? Little wiggly wiggly. <laughs> so it's kind of cool. Like we have it on both sides. Like, with with this game, it's pure Japanese simulator. You know, with sleeping dog, fucking Tekken style combat. It's locked, but I should be able to bypass it. it calls for a wire. Okay, this is this weird thing. This bi thumb bypass thing or something. Like, what is this? How do we do this? Oh, hold on. I didn't actually read that. I read. Yeah, a simple thumb turn bypass. What is that? Call for a wire, which I'm out of at the moment. Okay, fuck. Either I wait for later. I don't know what that is. Is it, um... Oh, shit. Doesn't like this door. Where do I get one? Thumb turn wire? What? You didn't provide me with one, game. Hmm? What? Hmm. Boost attack? Cool. I don't know what to do here. Some, yeah. Steady hands, is this it? Yeah. Wires break less during a thumb turn bypass. Yeah, 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 yeah. You haven't told me how to get said turn 
point turn by path. What? Where do we get the wire from? This is weird. Am I confused? Am I supposed to buy something? What the fuck? What am I supposed to do? I can't go upstairs. Hmm? There's gotta be a way. Can I climb up here? Come on. I can't let a couple of boxes stop us. Oh, there we go. Why didn't you fucking tell me? Tin wire. God damn it! No, now load the tutorial. God damn it! Tiny, tiny little wire. Alright, let's see what this is. Yeah, I was thinking this is what it is. So it goes uh, behind the door. Now you'd need a bit, bit more than a wire to actually unlock one of those, right? Assistant Sandman turning into sand and going through the lock. Hey, graveyard dude, how you doing? Hello, lads. How was your weekend? Also, over the weekend in the town of Mexico, it hailed 1.3 meters of rain. Wow. Uh, oh, no, it, it, it actual hail, yeah. That's so weird. That is so weird. I'm telling you, these fucking uh, magnetic poles are shifting slowly but surely. Like, look at us getting this unprecedented heat wave, and I know it's like summer and all that. All right. Let's see how we do this. This is cool. This, this is for... The, okay. Tum turn bypass. Tum turn bypass. Your mom's a bypass. Oh, what in the hell? What in the hell is this? This is cool. And then go down. Okay. It's different. Oh, shit. Fuck. Yay! Almost there. Almost heaven. West Virginia. Mamma mia. Alright. Perfect. Simple. So we have lock picking and this. The wire broke. Won't be able to use that one anymore. It was meant to happen. Yagami is a tall son of a bitch. Nope. Is this? No, that's not hard. This is the reception. So let's not get caught. We were in this building before. We whooped ass, but we didn't know that he had to wit witness his sister. Uh oh. Time for a QT. Who's this dude? Oh, he's bringing down all the stuff for the bad guys. <laughs> that's where the 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 thugs props come from. No. Uh oh. Indiana Jones slide under. No, we're gonna have to whoop this guy's ass. Look at all the beautiful stuff he gave us to pick up them. His name is Hori. We got a medical kit. Look at all this beautiful stuff. You're so kind. First I'm gonna pick up this bucket. Cause you're all bucket head. Come here bucket head. Wouldn't. Hey man, I just wanna put the bucket on your head. This dude don't fuck around. Ugh! Don't disrespect my bucket. Alright then, you want some of this? How did I miss? Oh, you son of a bitch. Everybody was kung fu. Wait, I need um, more skills. I want that one to knock them when they're down. Where is it? A battle. Finishing block. Is that it? No. Uh, yo, 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 yo. Knock down enemy. The flowing kick. Me likey. Okay, let's grab it. Now we get to try it on your ass. Come on. Come on, bitch. Come on. Come on, dude! Come on, bitch! Oh, you blocked us! Can't fuck with my tiger style! This is much better when it's one on one. It's very hard to. You're doing so, like 15 guys. How do we f throw them again? Oh, he actually headbutted me that time. I need to figure. There it is! I love that! Now let's try. Get him when he's knocked down. Yes! EX boost! This poor bastard, I feel sorry for his mama. Oh, how did that miss? Oh man, all the cool moves keep missing. It's not cool, man. I just want to do flips and shit. See, so, yeah, I need to get a move to stop that shit. Alright. Take my sledgehammer. Take my wife. Take the back end of my foot. Oh, how does that miss? I gotta get better at them. I wonder how you... How you get it right? See, it's not connected. See? Oh, he blocked that one. Okay. Get off me! You don't know me like that. Fucking throw him around the place. All right, we gotta end. You gotta end strong. Oh. Come on, you bitch. End strong. Oh. Wait, all doesn't really do anything. It's just for dodging. Okay. Let's go. Make a little lunch. Nice. What is for lunch? I want some food, man. Make me some. Make me sandwiches. What do I just fucking headbutt you? You can change to flying crayon style. <laughs> that was beautiful. Look at all this stuff we dropped.
Kick down the door. Yeah, you. I wrecked the you, whole office. This guy had a little golf touched. set, and I messed all that up. I don't know nothing, honest. Hopefully, it's not I'm too loud here. in the battles. Trying to shit. get some kind huh? of balance going on here. Well, you're useless now that I moved the PS4, there's it's no stupid noise. Oh, that was so cool. No way to go, but some up. soup. Night. No, yeah, cool. Then a new marquee for the arcade. Ooh. Finish him. Yeah, hell yeah. This is why I love the combat on this. Should have seen when I was fighting those ten guys in the alley. It was kind of like boss characters. I came where there's a big um, uh, health bar on the bottom. So the case, we've almost closed this case, this tree blind mice case. But uh, just as your man was about to testify, they, the Yakuza clan, fucking um, kidnap his sister. So this is why we've we're only a, a private detective. So we're we're kind of able to skirt around the law. Nice. If you get me, we're not. We used to be a lawyer, but we're able to skirt around the law, Almost and this there. is why we're able to chase down the sister, oh, kick boy. some ass, and continue the trial. What's weird is we're defending like one of the generals in the uh, oh, in the uh, rival Yakuza bitch. clan. Now we got all these guys and no toothbrush. Man, oh. oh, how do I make those connect? I'm really bad at it. This is why they gave me uh... Now I can get this. Oh man, he's laying into me. Bitch! Try and get rid of his little bastards first. It's hard to build up your EX bar. I thought it'd be a little bit easier. Ooh, he got fucked up. Alright. Oh, he dodged it! That was pretty badass though. Damn it! Alright, the bat, the baseball bat broke anyway. Might be better to get these guys in a... That was a nice finisher. Let's get rid of his little friends. This guy's getting fucked up. Fucked up! Oh! Toasty, motherfucker! Now you're next, bitch tips! See, I think that's what's wrong. I'm using the EX moves instead of like... Uh, or EX boost instead of EX moves. Tiger stance. Better use that medical kit. Actually, I was supposed to go to the doctor, wasn't I? Yeah. Items. Come on, bitch! So, uh, yeah, I keep using the EX meter to. I end up uh, wasting it on the EX boost instead of an actual move. Damn, they're really good at fucking dodging those. Come on. Bastard. Using the camera angle to your advantage, I see. Ah! God damn! Come on. Use your cool wall moves, man. Those never connect for me. I must be. I just suck with them, I suppose. Damn, get out of the corner, man! That's more like it. I think it maybe just something got to do with the lock on, maybe? Maybe you gotta like aim it while you're kicking. Yeah, maybe that's it. I don't know. We'll figure it out. Man, that did not hit me. Let's get action replay. Let's finish this little bitch off. With a nice flying fucking kick. Whoa! That five hit is nasty. Oh, how did that miss? Whoa! There's so many moves to unlock. Ah! Oh. Pyro with the shit and Tarita, how's it going, guys? And Gula Ghouls as well. How you doing? How was everyone's weekend? I'm getting sweaty just playing this game. These guys roll up with katanas and baseball bats. One guy had a wooden bucket. Ah, oh, bucket! You know how it goes. Kill four guys, then start doing a lockpicking mini game. Ah, Japan. Where would we be without you? Almost there. West Virginia. Yes. Almost there. <laughs> Almost it's like there. going back to oblivion. Wow. Wow. Got, Got it. it. Hey, this is a lovely office. Do you really want me to fuck it up? Fine, hold on, let me pick up. Hold on, there's goodies over here. Hold on. You got stamina on me now. 
Tiger crane style! Oh, you done fucked up now! Hey, whose plant was that? Come on, dude. Oh, double whammy! On your mammy. It's a nice TV. It's about a, a 32 inch Sony Bravia. Like Bravio. Ravioli. I'm gonna throw that table on your ass. Now we got an actual table on your. T there you go. Come on, dude. I have so much more stuff. Fuck your couch. Fuck your table. Really, guys? Now watch. It's gonna load a cutscene, probably. And the, the the whole office will be fine. That's a nice chair. That's a nice chair. In Japan, everything is a melee weapon. Everything. Even all grannies and Zimmer friends. Oh, Jesus! I haven't seen this excitement since World War II. Oh, shit. <sighs> You're chilling? You're chilling in Portugal? Yes. No. What? Hold on, I missed what you are saying there. Are you in, are you on holidays now, Pyro? And you're in my stream, you mad joke. I'm good, thanks. Hope you had a good weekend. Yay! Hope everyone had a great weekend. Hell yeah. I my weekend was pretty good. It was hot. It was hot. Portugal. Which is pretty good because I don't really want to get burnt. Yeah, are you really in um, what are you doing in my stream? Are you on holidays, motherfucker? Everybody. Everybody. Yeah, we got proper here as well. Hello, motherfucker. Damn. Bring me back a souvenir, you ungrateful bastard. Right, where's the girl? Where's if you the get girl? these right, you get a little uh, skill point She's bonus. Up in the this game is insane. Room. I love it. It's like a it. one half Japanese simulator, second half crazy fucking Japanese movie. I just picked up a moped earlier and smacked the shit out of someone with it. Uh, and it was awesome. It was awesome. All right, gotta get info. I need and fast. Hmm. It's the code for the door. What's the code great for success? <laughs> like you gotta love these. You. Yeah. Oh! Now he's not gonna be able to tell you the code. I don't have time. It's gonna sound like Michael Jackson. Understand? Now I'm gonna ask you again. What's the code to the reception room? One, three, seven. Someone seven. remember that. Well, that was so hard. Thanks. Must be hot in Portugal. Yeah, I see a lot of people going to Portugal now. They're trying to get the tourism back up after Madeleine McCann. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck the McCanns. <laughs> I'm, I'm telling you. Wait for it. Her third book will be from prison. All right, this is the, this is a weird bit. Matching key. Let's this see. bit's so fucking weird. Why would I want to pick a key? I think I got this key earlier. So, we're in the middle of a case. We were actually in the trial. And it turned out our key witness went and told a bold-faced lie, the little bitch. But it turns out he was being, um... He's, he's being kind of coerced by the fucking... Wait, do I... What about the code? Right. Uh, by a rival Yakuza clan who has... Nice. Kidnapped his sister. And basically said, if you don't say what we want you to say... She dies, and we're us being the private detective badass. Um, we have no. Let's see. We don't. We you know we're not a lawyer. We don't give a fuck. So we're able to leave the courtroom and go on a mad killing spree. Almost to save the there. Sister. Come on, man. This is quite finicky. Nice. Think, so, I mean, that's what it's supposed to be. I'd say you. I think you can get a, a skills to make it look less that's sensitive. Good. It's very sensitive. Novice lock spit. You know it. I said lock spit. <laughs> I spit on the lock. Damn! <laughs> yeah, you don't want to get burnt. No, no one wants to do I, I probably won't get burnt even in this heat. See, it sucks. You want to wait till it's really wet. Why won't you go in? There you go. You want to wait till the wet shit here, then go away and go, Bye, motherfuckers! Or, like, when it's hot here, go, like, uh, skiing. There she is. Now, after... Uh, take care of her little minders. So have you seen this sister, streamer? Right? Streamer who Don't calls worry. scammers. No. Uh, Yagami. I've been all day, so here? try to take a look and see what's going on. Let well, I appreciate that. Come. Thank you. Right Pyro, enjoy your vacation. Enjoy your holidays. Mean? Nothing new, apparently. Wow. Apparently. Apparently, it's my first wants. time in the sun. Apparently. Apparently. I've seen a guy doing that. It's all fine yeah. If you aren't oh, ghouls! I I went and checked out that guy that the link you put in your Discord. 
I watched them for like two hours. This dude is fucking crazy. The Mark guy, he does kind of like, um, geez, what would you call it? Spontaneous music. <laughs> no, Jesus, I don't know what the hell you call it. He basically makes music up on the spot. He's an absolute cracking dude. Absolute genius. Genius. I want to see that that Mark guy um, do a collab with Imogen Heap because she she loves that kind of looping and weird uh, technology inside music. She has these gloves. Oh my God, these crazy gloves that she's created. Come on. That make sure this will make noise and loop things, and she can control the whole system in her gloves. It's kind of like insane. It's something you'd see in like a, a sci-fi movie. And, she, and not to mention, she's also an incredible singer and, and pretty genius. I could be in trouble here, guys, because I didn't get. No, I need. You can buy some ramen in the game, and I need to do that. Damn that EX mode didn't lock. What's he? Oh no, I'm gonna fucking die. It only gave me one health kit. No! No! Fuck, you just got a swinging. Jesus Christ, I went in there with no health. Thanks for nothing. I was watching, right? Uh, who was I watching? Do you remember um, Andy Mel Melokas? What's his name? Me Mel I can never fucking say his name. Melonakis. He was on MTV. The Andy Show, the Andy Milanakis Show, or Milanak. I I actually I don't really watch much of that because uh, you know ten years ago MTV had already kind of lost its spark. But that dude, that dude streams. He streams. He's got like eight hundred thousand people over here on Twitch, and he was streaming Venice Beach yesterday. Pyro is Illuminati. Wait, what? What? What's what? I spit on the lock props. It wasn't opening, so I spit on it. I looped it up a little <laughs> and it just the lock pick slid right in it's simple what are we talking about here yeah see I done died they didn't give me any health no I didn't even know like I think I need to get some some take out some mushu get some mushu Come on. let's make sure this asshole no soul food again. no <laughs> no so I ain't no punk bitch no soul food I ain't asked for no soul food I want some mushu motherfucker I ain't no punk bitch! If it's not Naughty Professor, it's Rush Hour. That's what you get! You sit down, stop gloating about your nice new TV. I didn't know you had one of them curved TVs. It's not a curved TV! You done broke my shit! It curves now! It curves 360 degrees! Cause I chopped it in half. Let's switch over to the flying crane style. Dude, come on! I'm trying to... I'm trying to act real cool here. This poor woman in the corner going, he's fucking up the whole office! The last remaining chair! Yeah! yeah. Wasn't even comfortable! This chair gave me hemorrhoids! <laughs> ba -ba 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 -ba. I got hemorrhoids! <laughs> I got hemorrhoids! What was that meme? You can't sit with us, Lacey! Oh, that's fine. I can't sit anywhere. Because I got hemorrhoids. I've got hemorrhoids. Come on! Get off the subject of hemorrhoids. This dude's a sick bitch! Alright. Oh no, not the table. I wanted to leave one. I can't move, I'm like stuck in the NPC! Fuck! How could this happen? In this day of days. Come on, bitch! Watch now, there'll be a cutscene after this. God damn, there's gotta be a way of getting out of those. I'm hitting, getting hit five times. What the fuck? Oh, you're pissing me off. Fuck that shit. How do you break out with those five hit combos? Now he's smacking the wall. Fucking take that, you little bitch. Ah, oh, my God. This is tough. Ah. Ah. Mark, he's a good dude from Dallas. Nice. I wouldn't really know. I didn't really have an accent, right? Just moved to New York. Cool. Trying to live the dream. Yeah, he's. I, I went. I actually went back and watched some of his other stuff. His clips are awesome. Like that. That's the dude gets funky as well. Like that's. He he likes all parts of music, and that's the same as me. So I'm like hell yeah. One minute he's going full on like trap music. Come on, Next minute he's sure doing fucking funk, and then he rubs a bit of soul on it, a bit of stank. It was really good. Um, and no one ever really messes around with like callers anymore, you know, unless it's a radio show. See, flying crane style is AOE kind of stuff, you see? And then, um, a Thorby. 
Fuck you! And your mother too! This guy done appeared from the wall! Can we call exorcist? Oh! Damn, I love this game! Uh, who, who left? When I said sit the fuck down, I meant it, Kai. Oh, Sony Bravia. You're gonna feel the pixels, bitch! Feel them! That ain't 3D, that's 6D! Alright, we don't let this guy get any... Oh, bollocks. Straight away. That. See, you can block. I think the dodge is better. It's just it's very instant, right? Maybe I should... Yeah, okay. What's this? Is cactus a chair? Fuck your chair, man! I'm gonna sue that dude. He owes me a leg chair. A chair leg. Was that the Hawaii Five? Yeah, on hemorrhoids? Oh, no. Jeez, this guy's got some moves, too. Damn! Well, look, my man, gonna start out my own thing. Beast in Overwatch. All right, cool. Cheers for coming in. Nice! Oh my god, taste the back of my foot. Hello? No, I want the phone. I'm not the coffee table. Oh, yeah. Jesus. Now you can't get out of those five hit combos. And then he blocks my shit. I do the coolest move ever, and he's just like, now you're fine. Fuck you. <laughs> yeah, I went back for the table. Poor chicken in the corner is just like, I fucking hate Japan, man. Every time. All I wanted was a bit of ramen. Little Mushu. Oh, he's trying to box her. Damn it, I hate when he knocks you down like that. That's more like it. Hit him, goddammit. The floor will hit itself. Ah, oh, fuck me. Bra bra. <laughs> Damn it! All my cool shit gets blocked. Damn. Oh, he hits me when I'm down too. Oh, you sick bastard. Sorry, Wall. Oh, now I'm doing the splits. Grab the whore. That's it. Throw him. Call his mom on the phone. Come pick this guy up, he's a crazy bitch. Ah, fuck. Man, this is tough. I thought I got enough health when I updated, obviously not. Whoo! You watch Andy as well? Yeah, he, he plays GT. Yeah, so he was walking around um, uh, Venice Beach, you know? Continue on easy day. Fuck off. I hate when games do that. Excuse me for not having all the moves straight away. Ah. But yeah, that was cool. So I appreciate you linking that, goes. I like to find new weird shit. The people ringing up are so funny. The whores, they won't turn down the fucking stream, so they listen to the stream like, Oh, that's me on stream. And, and Mark's talking to me. Oh my god. And there's a 15 second delay and Mark's like, Can you fuck? can you hear me? You got, you got a little Yeah. I wish all the best to that dude, because, uh, fuck yeah. I, I love music and to see someone that creative, just that spontaneous... Try and do that. Come on. Sometimes he doesn't like to climb up on the wall. Come on, dude. If I tell you to climb on the wall, you better climb on that wall. There's too many dudes in a tiny fucking room with a chick in the corner. Ugh. I think I lost my EX move as well. Shit! Shit! Yeah, so he, he was on. Uh, Andy was on Venice Beach and there's a couple of fucking. Met out dudes, or maybe maybe he's crack. I don't know. Who knows? He had an invisible notepad, and he was happy to ask people a lot of questions. And then he got an Uber to get the fuck out of there because he was getting some bad vibes. And uh, he started to role play real life GTA in the car. It was so funny. The chat was lit up though. Right, bitch. Just me and you now. I fucking blocked that. Kitty. I think there's a couple of combinations. Oh my lord, I didn't even know I did meant to do that. I, no, that was on purpose, I swear. You don't believe me? Ugh. Don't touch the doom, motherfucker. No one touches the doom. See, R1's supposed to lock on. You ain't locking on shit. How do you. God dang it. Is it triangle? Triangle kicks the shit out. Cool. It's actually pretty fucking uh, deep combat system. I'm just need to get the hang of it, right? 
See what I'm talking about? Five hit non blockable combo. Kiss my ass, bitch. And he blocks my shit. Ah! How long it takes him to get up? No, I don't know how, why he won't do that. Come on! No, he just, he just want to be picked up. Oh, come on! He's allowed to ever do it. Fuck! Come on! How do we stop this son of a bitch? I've cleaned up the room for you. You don't need to call any of the fucking moving crew. I fucking grabbed you first. You see, it's like a fighting game. It's fucking crazy. I, I, I don't know what you want me to do again. Tiger one is supposed to be better at one on one. That's more fucking like it. Yes! Knee face wall. It's hard to build up that EX meter. Probably just a skill I'm missing. Where you probably. No, he's not even facing the right way. You almost got him. No! He almost gets the kick after that, you're such a bastard. No! I will not die on this day! Yes! Yeah, there's probably a move for getting my ass off the floor faster, because that's some bullshit. I'm slamming that X button like it's going out of style. See, it's uh, telling you, you go from like lock picking to that, it's sweaty. Come on. There's complications so of people mistaking Andy for a be. woman. Really? Marasi's son. Hasn't this gone on long enough? I know he has some kind of growth thing, right? Some little disorder or whatever. That's because he's in his forties. I was like, shit. Someone else clearly. That sucks. There's no reason. It was funny that he was doing the real life. I think chat was egging him on, and he was doing the role play to the Uber guys. He's like, pick me up here. I'm going to Los Santos. And the dude in the car was like, oh, he seems like a normal nice guy. And then by the time Andy got out of the Uber, he's like, he's a cracked out motherfucker. <laughs> All these names from uh, the role playing stuff. Oh, be right. All right, no worries. Enjoy the walk with the doggos. GG. Yeah, that, that was pretty tough. I need to get some more uh, moves, that's for sure. He didn't contact you. I beat the shit out of this purple guy three times now. The way I see it. Kume never left a more. In other words, Hamra must have handed him over to the real murderer. While Hamra was at the sauna making an alibi for himself, someone else was murdering oh, Kume. Was it you? And gouging his eyes. Who the out. fuck did the killing? It almost makes sense. If Hamra ends up behind bars, I'll never be able to prove that theory. So what? You want to let Hamra walk? Better you lagged for a while. A girl to stop someone from end. testifying. Besides, I thought you were above shit like this. <laughs> All right, just get out of here. You got guts for a detective. I love the way he's able to like mess with an Thanks. investigation like this. I assume that you're not really allowed to do that kind of stuff. All right. The rest is up to Shintani. Yes, it is. After all, it is his case. But Hamura's it comes down to this guy. Will he testify? This video. The same man standing here today. I remember now. There's no doubt in my mind. So, you retract your earlier statement? Yes. My apologies. Your Honor, clearly this witness has no mm. credibility. How does the defense respond? I admit, the witness was shaken up before. But I believe that's a perfectly understandable response. This is his first time in court, after all. I have no doubts regarding his credibility. Hmm. We'll see. This guy's gonna be pissed. This Stardust establishment. It's a host club, yes? How long have you been employed there? About two years. For that short a time frame? You seem to have an awful lot of trouble with your customers. Huh? I'm not sure what you mean. 
Several of them have approached you in hopes of marriage. No, they Lord. Not? They come spending huge sums of cash. So you act like you're ready to seal the deal. You say whatever it takes to make them. This is why he was going on so many dates. But your story changes once things start to get real. Five women have filed reports with the Consumer Affairs Bureau. Need to order a multi-pack of Ramen. Yeah, you can buy stuff out of vending machines, Dynamite, for Do use in really battle. Trust the words of such a manipulative man. With these character traits in mind, I sincerely doubt the credibility of the witness's testimony. And if the witness is indeed lying, the defendant. See, at the end of the day, we don't need to convince the fucking witness. It's the jury. How does the defense but I don't know. There is no jury. I don't I'd think like it's, it's on the all those people in the back. Maybe. Mind if I don't know I who they are. The Japanese the courtroom is probably way different than what we know as well. First. You know. Allow me to fast forward. As far as I can tell, nobody has sworn an oath to, to you know, not to lie and stuff. Enough, we'll Nobody's sworn under oath. Day the prosecution filed their so that guy was able to like go back mm -hmm. on his statement. <sighs> Isn't that <laughs> you, prosecutor? Uh, oh look, he's going over yes. the footage. And in this footage. Yeah. You're reenacting the altercation that took place between the defendant and our witness, yes? What? No. In a world no. where well, Photoshop and deepfakes strange. exist, you stated earlier um, that you had it's going to be pretty hard for anything like CCTV footage or then, video footage in general to be, be used. To reenact things exactly as they went down. Cyber. What? What is that? You I'm looking on. Did you send that on you Discord? Did not inspect the area yourself. Let me see, Burns. It seems that wasn't the truth. Why are you hiding the truth from us, prosecutor? Yeah, that's not food, dude. You're wrong. As you can see, the original footage isn't exactly clear. I would understand if you would deny that the defendant was the man who punched our witness. But instead, you claimed you hadn't seen the footage at all. If I had a guess, when you first saw the footage, you realized Hamra. He, he turns his face. Man. It's clearly Hamra. At the very least, you couldn't rule out the possibility. The problem is, I think, like, this case so is pretty lie, cut and dry. But it's, it's not Hamra. That, but I true. think us helping Hamra. Sure we're, we're basically letting the bad guy go. The overall bad guy. Do you get me? In a court of law. And unfortunately for you, there's only one person who thinks the defendant is guilty. And that's you, prosecutor. The night Kume got murdered, Hamura was holed up in sauna go ten till morning. The footage from the security camera, Hamura's alibi, Seiya's testimony, it all lined up. With a story that airtight, there's no chance he could have mm. killed Kume. We find the defendant, Kyohei Hamura. Not guilty. Yay! Oh God, have we done the right thing, though? By the reasoning behind this decision, defendant, please be seated. The judge was right. Hamura definitely didn't kill Who Kume. The fuck One of his men. But he had to have been involved. Meanwhile, the real killer is still out there. Hiding in the shadows of Kamurocho. Murdering Yakuza. Gouging cool. the eyes out. Retreating into his den. So, I've given him a name. The Ooh! Mower. So somebody, there's a Yakuza killer. That's kind of crazy. His job is done once he proves the defendant innocent. In one moment, you're like, fuck the loss, right? It, they're but stupid me, Yakuza gang members, you know? Let I'm them kill each other. Not anymore. Meaning my search for the truth nice. only ends when I say it does. But I still think that's why the case is called Three Blind Mice. My office might be small, but that doesn't mean I don't have a reputation to uphold. So much, like, drama and stuff. It's awesome. In other words... So much weight. I'll do you gotta give it to them. Takes. Wait to see, by the end of this game, I'm gonna be a wrecking machine with the combat. Surprised the helper must go like right across the screen then. Yeah. 
so he cannot owe us a favor now but it's still justice even though if it's not full you know that kind of way he still is innocent even if he paid someone else yeah, me, son. this guy's probably a reporter gorgeous day how's the detective business they introduced like at least 15 people pretty fast so yeah I knew you'd show up here Hattori. forgive me if I forget a couple of people listen I'm not in the mood for your shit today yeah, but it's my journalistic yeah, duty go. to hear what you have to say it's not personal just trying to do my job okay there you go cool Hattori. Well, I've already seen so his, his so first name would be Cole, business. is it? This is why I get so confused. Lawyer lets a murderer walk. It's like they've changed it for the Western audience. There's many people with the Hattori uh, name and yeah, last name. No, you're the only reason the girl died. You just had to go and set that killer free, didn't you? So he's talking about uh, good people who one of Yagami's, Yagami's past cases. You can't be coming back now. This is what, what would led him to... to, say to that? I think uh, it was when he was Yagami's a lawyer. Son. It led him to quit. No need to quit worry like the that. law firm, quit being a lawyer. And now he's kind of going out on his own. But as you can see, it's, it's already Stay allowed around, us to... Um, aid a trial without being involved either side, you know. In this case, we freed uh, the sister of a witness who was being, I suppose, would you, I don't know, would you say, like, a badgered, badgered witness? Alright, so this will move on to chapter two then. Each chapter seems to revolve around the, an overall case, which makes more sense. Shops. See, there's 407 shops. If that, you know, there's not 407 shops where we are, so you can definitely tell that, um, there's going to be multiple areas. Yeah, beneath the surface is what this one's called. Cool. Yeah, Borderlands 3 and Cyberpunk. Damn, it's a nice mix, right? I'm still trying to see who will join us in our Dead by Daylight roleplay. I thought you were going to do it inside the inside the game. The year is 2018. Oh man, this cool goes though, motherfucker. Kamarocho is playing host to Kansai-based Yakuza, who've been turning up dead with their eyes gouged out. Previously. Lawyer turned detective Takayuki Yagami took on the case, proving the suspect's alibi. But he can't shake the feeling that the truth. Of course, and then there's this here. huge gang. Uh, there seem to be kids, not kids. You know what I mean? Teenager, a teenager gang name, of uh, burglars and stuff. The mole. So cool. It's a big game, like same in Sinking City. Oh, and we get like the credits again. No, chapter two. Cool. Beneath the surface. If that hasn't got to do with that underground doctor, I don't know what is. I'm digging this, you know? This is something I can definitely sink my teeth into. And it may lead to me playing the other Yakuza games. Which, um, as far as I've heard, are quite cheesier. Three bodies have turned up in Kamarocho. Like there's karaoke and both eyes. dancing and stuff. Everyone a Kyori man. Kumi is mm. the most recent. And the guy who killed them all was your mole, huh? Yep. Got Kumi hand-delivered to him by Hamura. Uh, it's funny that they're actually showing us so much of the possible overall killer because as far as I can tell clothes don't change too much on you know the other characters the NPCs so if I see a guy with that kind of hair and that leather jacket I'm assuming that's the mole you know you wouldn't call him a mole unless he believes that he is inside uh, one of the Yakuza clans continue watching your spider-man streams nice let him get away with this I missed that game. It was very it's so very out. simple. I've never seen a game just to pick up and go. I bet you that's one you wish you could play. I hate excuse bullshit. Why would the captain want to protect the do. mole anyways? He could have gotten life in the slammer if things went south. Hard to say with what we know now. We'll be in the first game. Yeah. First, we need to figure out who the mole is. That's why we're here, remember? The mole's first victim was found right in this very alley. Mm-hmm. Happened back in August. Kenkichi Mashiba, a Kyore guy, 27. Pretty small time. Even lower rank than Kume. Body got reported in the morning. Eyes gouged clean out yeah. of his skull. Cross was probably pretty much the same way as Kume. Where exactly did they find him? What sort of the, uh, the eyes being gouged sure. out is like a Kasha very telling sign, you know? Almost well, like a ritual killer. We'll have to do one better then. 
It's uh, the obvious up, call and sign of the this guy, did which is now, if that's the case, the that's two cases, they you're, you're now in the class of Why serial you killer, you know? Alright. Shut up, you're making me doubt myself, lol. We have to do it. Don't worry, yeah. we got this. Oh, Don't doubt easy, yourself, huh? buddy. If anyone's gonna know about the mole, it's Hamura. And who has better access to him than anyone else? I seen there was a little news story about um, Remedy Entertainment getting the rights to we'll Alan Wake back from Microsoft, first, which is though. which is good. Way to find Always good is to see good old devs owning their own IP, and I good on Microsoft. Fashion. Hopefully, it was just a licensing thing, Anyways, um, not like a bloody battle in, or uh, you know money October. changing hands or something. I don't. I hate Found to see that. But uh, this also means that we may see Alan Wake Shall on. Um, PS4 head over alone, and no Switch, problem. maybe, which all also means you know more money for the dev, uh -huh. which could lead to a sequel because uh -huh. we've, we've been needing a sequel. It's pretty obvious that they have something in the works, you know, pretty like early. They're obviously working on Control, which is coming out in August. I will be playing that, and they had uh, Quantum Break. It would be nice to see them get Max Payne back, but I think a lot of people were kind of um, the, uh, kind of on the fence with Max Payne Three. You know, a lot of people liked it, a lot of people missed the old style, but. I don't know. Didn't you say something about him selling police info? If he's got info on the mole. No doubt does. Yeah, they tried yep. to become human. That should it. be coming to everything Thanks. soon enough because all the other. Uh, what's the name of that dev? Uh, Quantum Dream. Quantum Dream games are all on PC and stuff now. Uh, Heavy Rain, Beyond Two Souls, Fahrenheit. So expect Detroit Become Human to make its way over to Xbox pretty soon. That's That's another case of. A kind of second party dev like Insomniac that just kind of want to have everybody play their games, you know? Which is completely understandable. But yeah, I, I was always a big fan of Alan Wake. I think right now, I think in terms of atmosphere and that, it probably holds up, but the combat was pretty shallow, you know? It was pretty much light the fuck on fire, blown away with a shotgun, rinse and repeat. But it was still fun, you know, creepy moments, and I would like to see them take that further, you know? I'd like to see it push through and make it similar to Alan, uh, Alan Wake, like, um, they did, they did something in between, it was like a live action thing. It was also that American Nightmare thing, which was really cool, you know, it brought like a arcade side to, shaving is a never ending cycle. Okay. It's pretty random. Alright, we're going to the second crime scene. There are, there are side cases, like I said, and and there's these things you can do. I think that's what this means, this little um, two hands shaking. I think that's got to do with... Um, actually, you know what? I don't know. I thought it was about these friendship... You do these like friendship quests and it leads to stuff. But, uh, is there a legend, maybe? Switch icons, close map, minimize, move pins. Is there... A, I don't know what it means. I'm starting to wonder if it just mean a uh, shopkeeper. That's what I'm thinking now. Because it's like change hands, change... See, that's from Smile Burger. It was like a merchant thing. And what's this then? No, see, this is a friendship thing. I don't fucking know. I think there's multiple girlfriends in the game as well. It's a big, big game. We've just cracked the first big case. Oh no, these are all motherfuckers. All right, let's go then. Out of the way. There's, I think there's about five different styles of fighting as well. There's, that, there's a drunken fight where drunken style that switches over to when when you actually get intoxicated, which I want to try soon enough. What I need to do probably is just learn how to block more, you know. Well, I think I might actually upgrade my health again, but I, it's gonna go across the screen. stay down. It's crazy. I have enough for it though. This one here, 2700 and I have 3800. Alright. Let me get to. I knocked a new skill. Watch this now. Boom! Look at all that health. God damn! Here come the popo. I didn't know nothing. Yeah, did you ever. Did I. No, I didn't play Detroit Become Human. I, I'm not really a big fan of those on on the channel. I don't know. It's, it's one of those games. I, I was kind of in between, but. Um, I don't know, it's, just, it's kind of like the same with Walking Dead and all that. I would rather do them as videos. There's just so much talking and stuff. I, I was, I kind of fell out of love with his games. I really liked um, his, one of his first games. Uh, 
Fahrenheit, which uh, in America was called Indigo Prophecy. And then Beyond Two Souls is such a wasted opportunity. It's like a walking movie. And, I, and the cool thing about Detroit, like it is very, very, it's beautiful, it's, it's a clever uh, premise, but it's also been done to death in movies, you know? The whole idea of, um, you know, the, the almost like fucking, the social divide between androids and humans in the future. And the upright, what's this, what's wrong with this guy, why are you, what's wrong, can I help you? It's a cat. Excuse me. Nico Mia, okay. You haven't happened to see any cute little kittens around. I have! Looking mm -hmm. for kittens out there? Friend event! Alright. But I mean, it's not a bad game. I played the demo, dude. And I was like, okay, I kind of see what's going on here. Heavy Rain was fun, but um, it's kind of like, like these kinds of types of games. I don't know, it's funny. Like, I try and balance things, so by the time that one came out, you want to try and take a game that's more serious i know like it became a meme as well that was the thing oh alan wake no i didn't i don't think i played on it was before i played it before um before i started youtube yeah it's it's weird like detroit become human was just another one of their games not a, a bit of fanfare but not a whole lot and then it just became this fucking meme and then all the big boys started playing it and then it took off from there you know and th that's a that's one of those games that's a pure sign of uh, where YouTube boasted the game, you know. You know, a lot a lot of these devs argue that let's players and and live streams only lessen people buying their game, which is not not always true. I mean, mm -hmm. it's I think it's um it's a pretty 50-50 split. You're getting all that free advertisement. If people want to go buy it because of someone, that's awesome. You know, I think as more and more of these uh, journalists and outlets become um, less trusted, you know, when they come outed how much they're being paid off, um, the, these big YouTube channels and channels in general will become um, more trusted. But there's a lot of shady shit going on with YouTubers as well. A lot of them, you know, it was only after the whole Fire Festival thing that they, ha they, were, they actually had to genuinely say the words... I have got this game from the dev. Like, that was never a thing. Now it has to, you have to put it in a video, in the description, hashtag ad everywhere, you know? And it was all because of uh, whatever it was. I keep wanting to say the FCC, but I don't think it was, because that might be the airplanes, was it? Federal Communications Commission. No, it was the FCC. Yeah, it was a huge thing about um, transparency when it comes to just straight up fucking paying people to advertise your shit. Like games where choices are- Yeah, that is true, and I suppose that's one of the games where there genuinely is multiple endings. I say good riddance. Come on, man, cats aren't that bad. <laughs> Let me guess. You're also a fellow feline fanatic. What a, what a name. But yeah, like there's a lot of games out there that just have the cutscenes ready and waiting. That sucks. But most people wouldn't even know who Quantum Dream were, or what Detroit Become Human was, if it wasn't for these big channels. That's honest to God. And that's the good side of it. It's just, like I said, they're being well paid. Alright. I thought I was searching for them already, but this might be the actual mission to bring out um, the whole kitten collectible stuff. Okay, I'll take that. We should exchange that. Oh, God. I'm Yagami, so what kind of catch up are you looking for? Right, I'm starting off with the Calico. Calico? He's a bit of a scaredy cat, so I got he's gone too far. Alright. What a nuisance, but I guess couldn't hurt to keep an eye on. Be counting on you. Oh, hopefully, this is the same quest, is it? Let's see, how do we like check cases? Is it got to do with. Are they both here? Main case tasks. Alright. Cool. Side case. Let's see? I like that it's all on the phone. I know it was popularized with GTA and that one. Still, can I just put a flight, take to the skies? Cool! I didn't know you could do that. I thought it had to be at certain times. Cost. There is drone races as well. Theodore's cherished pigeon. That's the pigeon he put on the front of a look. Whoa! Motor. Better. But yeah, it's interesting. But yeah, it is a cool game. It's just like I. At this, this point where they, they, they did another 
Blade Runner and you got Ex Machina and you got all these kind of games, Ghost in the Shell coming back. You just kind of get really, really burnt out on these kind of... And I do love, I do love this idea because we are getting to that point in the next like, you know, 20 years or so where the lines between technology and humans will kind of slowly get bl more and more blurred. I mean, nowadays, people have their houses so kitted out with technology, it's kind of scary, you know? That from their doorbell to their smoke alarm to their Roombas, to every all on one little system. People laugh when they talk about, like, Skynet and all that kind of stuff, but... I mean... These companies already sell your data to whoever they they want, you know, it's always found out every, like, couple of months or whatever. Um, that's just a lesser extent of what Skynet did, you know? They're keeping all that stuff and people are just selling it on. And the next step is using your, your shit for nefarious nefarious deeds. Can I buy some stuff? Can I buy use this? I'm gonna buy some food. Maybe you can buy a little bowl of ramen you can keep on there or something. Or some pot noodle. There's another pot noodle, bitch! And a pot noodle. I don't know if you if it eats it straight away though, that's the problem. Yes, Welcome sir! Soba in hot broth. Mmm, chill soba. Tanuki? No! Tanuki, don't eat the raccoons! Chilled ka Katsune Soba. It's all soba. Katsudan. Chicken and spinach soba. Curry and rice. Curry roux. It's mixed with their famous soup. Alright, I'll take that. Egg and tempura? Yeah, your health is full. You see? Can I not take some of this with me? Alright, come on then. Oh, I need to find a way, Fuji Soba. I need to find a way to uh, actually t bring this some of this with me, like packaged. Maybe if we went to a store rather than a restaurant, we'll figure it out. Smile Burger. We'll figure it all out. Yeah. They're getting better and better, which is good. Quantum Dream. Damn, that's how you fuck them up. Him up, I'm gonna take your money. Bronze play. I should sell those as well. Damn, nice dodge, dude. I gotta get it. Give me I wanna try and build up that EX meter. That will start by me not using it all the time. Alright, second crime scene. I think we might start a little investigation here. Cheap castle. This is where the mole's second victim was found. If I recall, the body was found in the garbage dump. So around here. So now keep an eye out for a kitty. So the cats must load in when you go into investigation mode. This is so funny. Make friends with a ghost face. Damn it! Be friends with me. It's kind. Of, they kind of slunk around. The the, uh, the tails on the back is kind of unusual. It's kind of bluish. I suppose they they probably get a license to use the likeness of these killers, but they probably in some part of the agreement they have to make it sort of their own as well. So today is today officially yeah today is the first of July fucking July guys, and it's also Canada Day so, um, you know, here's to all you Canadians out there. I know a few of you. Let me see who oh, I know. Caval is obviously she's from Canada. I think Meadie's in Canada as well. Uh, Paul Fair TV. Yeah, I know a good few Canadians. Canadians seem like really you seem like really cool people. There you are, you little shite. At least the sound actually makes sense. What the? Oh, look, a cat! Alright. Nice. It couldn't be the same dumpster, and I doubt there would be evidence. It's been a long time ago. Dumpster. The body found here would have heard about it by now. Probably safe to say it wasn't in the trash. This locker? Hey. I think it goes out to Tehe Boulevard. Nice. You get little SP bonuses everywhere, so I'll take that. I like how much there is to do. This is where I take out the garbage? The corpse must have been lying around here. This case happened months ago, though. Don't suppose there are any traces of the body left. No, of course not, dude. There wouldn't even be any traces of the blood. It's all cleaned up by forensic. But you never know. What'd you find? A screw. An exquisite screw. 
totally unrelated to the case. Yes, there's some more signs of the murder. Well, thank God for that. I was about to say this it would be pretty stupid. Right. At least we know where it is. Whoa. There's really not much I can do without the police reports. I guess coming here was a waste of time. Ah, no, we found the kitty. That's all that matters. Yeah, like a lot of the Telltale games, or even like the Strange, whatever. You always have the cutscenes cooked up. This is what I was talking about. Look at these dudes. Now, I doubt this is the mole. Oh, man, he does parkour. Damn, that's so sick. Oh. I think this is more of one of the uh, the burglar gangs I was talking about. Look at these dudes. He's gonna break his ass, watch. <laughs> he broke his ass. My ass is broke. Whoa. Mm, he's just chilling here. Is the dude gonna run into me? Watch, 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 watch. Hey, what's up? No way! He stole our phone! What? Awesome. Please here. let this be your mini game. Spice this guy's out in daylight. What are you wearing a mask and all? Wait, wrong guy. No! Our phone. Okay, let's go. Yeah, we're gonna have a look at a mini game. This is so cool. I like these. I know it's just like a QTE event, but still. It's good crack. Not very good at them. Some bitch. Chase the masked man. See, I think he runs anyway, doesn't he? Okay. Cool. You won't get away. Over here. See, even if you're using that button anyway, still have to. Real bastard. Oh, son of a bitch! I thought it'd be X. You can't just jump whenever you want. Hold up. Yeah, even if we're using the analog stick, it doesn't seem to matter. Never! Avoid the cones, bro. Look at this! This is crazy. Oh, most man. You can actually hear his voice. That should be enough to kind of track him down a little bit. You almost got him, boys! You gotta move it, man! I'm just copying what he's doing now. Oh, can we squeeze through? I oh, don't. Come on, we got him. Just put your hand on him. Now he gets to tear off again. Damn it! Hey, this is where we just started. You won't get away. What did you hit there? You son of a bitch! Come on, you got him, dude. What the hell is this? This is insane. Distant chase complete. We were supposed to go in here. Let's confront this bastard. This man is the Legion. Yeah, 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 yeah. I see that. Look at him. There's a whole group of them like that. I would have slid on there. That's just me. Come on, Yagami. He's not. Oh, this is some Neo shit. He barely made that. We can't. We can't chase him. Yagami, go for it, dude. Oh. oh my god. Is he gonna bail out? Oh. Ooh. The dude saved this? You're not getting any thanks for that. Here. You earned this back. Yeah, why did he? Why did he take her phone then? Look, it wasn't a perfect plan, but it worked out in the end. He reminds me of like Casey Jones or something. So thanks. You know, you know from Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles. And I don't want your thanks, asshole. Where he's kind of like good, bad. <laughs> okay. See ya. Daylight sounds like yeah, yeah. So <sighs> that HDMI you might have slowed down the delay a little bit. See. Yeah, we're gonna play some bloodstained That's ritual of the night after this. Camarocho. Burglary ring. Maybe he pro exactly oh, Bernie. Cops can't catch him. A little fucking GPS or a tracking chip in it. Exactly, dude. Or he wanted our information. Or it might even be the same phone. Yeah, cut up, but y'all good. Alright, Kato. You got in touch with Aiba, okay. Scraping up what he can on the mole. 
This guy takes taking a long time. Just sit tight till we hear back. All right. Let's check our phone. You're dead right, Brian. All right. I'm exhausted. Maybe I should go check in on Genji Sensei. It's been a while since I heard from him. Speak with Genji. It's the guy in the stuffy lawyer's office. He is our sensei. Say cheese, motherfucker! Let's see. Will we see what pictures I've taken already? Looks like some funny ones. This this selfie in the cat cafe. Good times. Uh, this one of the QR code for uh, this random man who I do believe farted. He's probably the bad guy all along. And then I think I hit the button in my pocket or something. I'm sorry. It happens from time to time. What else we got on this phone? Map. I don't want this Kamur Kamuro go. What is that? Oh, this is like your stats and stuff. All right, cool. The drone as well. We see what the drone does. It just oh, you can't fly it here. Race record. Jesus, a lot. Where is this? Where is this race? This drone race? DLC. Mm hmm. I actually have some code I need to activate. How do we get down from here? Yeah. Boom! Now that's how you get down off a ladder. Well, won't let me go this way? Interesting. Yeah, I'm wondering. Oh, that's why. I'm wondering, can you get stuff from. No. Homeless Condo. What's a Condo? Oh, maybe that's his name. You think you did it? Did you do it? It's pretty you can't do emotes in the game. Like a wave or something. What's wrong with your goddamn stomach, dude? Is your appendix gonna burst? You know, that kind of money. Well, we can help you. Get some Moraboshi sense. Who's that? Alright. He's underground the sewers. You can get there through a manhole in the children's part. Yep, yeah, we were already kind of down there. Alright. I'm saying we tell him Kondo's ass in front. Please hurry. Why would a doctor be hanging around the sewers? Because he's underground. I'm going deeper underground. It says there's one here. The children's park. Maybe it's up over here, is it? Yeah. Alright, where's the manhole? This is where we race with our little friend. Will this do? There's a manhole cover here. Will this do? Nope, obviously not. There's nothing in this alleyway. Bushui. Oh, here's a guy. What, what do you want to do? What you do, dude? You down for Shugi? What's sh Shogi? Shogi? I've never heard of that. Head out. I don't got time to learn like a 15 minute game, dude. I want to go down to the sewers. Never mind, I didn't. Oh, so close. You will one day. One day you'll make such great friends, such beautiful friends. Seems like everyone's working out alright, and then I don't have the PS4 in here, so. Oh! Always making friends with me. You asked for it. Yeah, watch me make friends with this wall. Aya! Suck a Gucci! Damn, I thought I was locked on to one. They should have a little indicator that you're locked on there, I don't know. But I suppose it might spoil how combat looks. Just you do find yourself just looking mid-air for no reason. This guy's drunk, is he? Damn, we both hit each other. BAM! Oh, sick. I think he just Hello, smelled his own fight. Yeah, where is the sewers? I, I found it earlier. It said the children's park, which we were in, but I didn't see anything. I'm assuming it's these little flag posts, but maybe not always. Oh, there you go. It's not always the flag posts. Remember I found one. You want me to go here? It has to be here? Okay. 
pretty far away, but that's fine. We'll beat the crap out of anybody on the way. Shogi. Uh, there's also like um, Mahjong, which uh, is a very, very popular game. I don't know it that well. I think Mahjong and Backgammon are the same thing. I don't know for sure though. I've played a bit of Backgammon, but it's mainly one of those like Microsoft games or whatever. Solitaire. No, I've never played Solitaire with actual cards. <laughs> It's always just been that game you chill, kill some time with. Is this not the same park we were in? You wanna fight me? Fucking fight then, bitch! I love the way it does that. Bitch, slap him! Hey, there's a car coming. He just instantly fucking. That's how you end it, bitch. Not the way he actually like falls on the ground with that guys. kick. That'll tell you how much momentum he puts into it. Whole body just falls over. All right. So many manholes, so little time. I found this place by accident. Nothing. Japanese, Japanese chess. Yeah, it kind of did look a bit like checkers, actually. Two-player strategy game. Probably just has. Slightly um, different rules in checkers or chess, and you're all good. Chess, yeah. Look at all those, they're like Chinese games or something. Xianji? Shat, Shatranj? Shat, Shat, who do you shut on? Alright, maybe you can heal me as well. Excuse me. No, I used the health kit, didn't I? Mm -hmm. This is Yagami. Hmm. What was I supposed to say? Your homeboy is calling for you? Condor. The condor has left the nest. <laughs> it's like Chinese whispers. Is that all you got from that conversation? Alright, it was condor. Is this homeless guy who goes by condor, you know him? He's asking for help just now. <laughs> what? Condor San was? Yeah. He said his stomach was killing him. Yeah, he probably just needs some, like, heartburn medicine or something. Public Park Tree. Off he goes. This guy is gonna be able to help us too. Seems like a little side quest, but it kind of its main story too, so. We haven't really got into what this case is going to be, but it's obviously going to involve that masked legion, as uh, Fire Lily called it. Ah. <laughs> so, um, that CTR, Crash Team Racing, are going to do this Grand Prix thing. It's like a battle pass for Crash Team Racing, but it's all free. Can be multiple skins, uh, new characters, new races, all that good stuff. Just here come. What? Eat something strange again. Uh, let me think. Well, I did some dumpster diving at Pink Street yesterday. I knew I tasted something fishy. For God's sake! <laughs> Looks like Kondo Sands done it again. He actually sang it there. Sorry for your trouble. Okay, this guy's gonna be very helpful. This guy's always eating trash and messing his stomach up. That's not your job to help him, though. He's gonna eat some nasty Excuse food. Excuse me. I've been gonna, yeah, are you actually a doctor? Or at least I was, but that's all in the past. What happened? You get stung for a little bit of the old uh, malpractice? <laughs> but he's been down the dump since he lost his chance to become a professor, so he started helping us out instead. Uh? You talk too much, Kondo san. <laughs> As for you, hard. Yagami san, here's something for your trouble. I know it isn't much, but take it and get out of here. Medical kit, sweet. Small. You can now get treated by Murobushi. Mur Murobushi. Murobushi. I need to remember these names. And buy medical kits for him as well. I appreciate it either way. Well then, I'll be off now. Yeah, Kanto san, stay out of the goddamn garbage. Can't, I can't. Fish, like, gun off fish. Mucho dangerous. Is it limited? I don't know. I don't think so. Sounds like they just want to try and copy that style so that. Because people are so used to it now, you know. But it's all free. That's what's gonna introduce the uh, Tawny, and then they'll probably do another one to introduce Spyro, and maybe one last one to introduce someone else. But I mean, somebody—I don't know who it was was a game game reactor or whatever. I don't think they're around anymore. But they did a podcast talking about the success of the Insane Trilogy and uh, the CTR remaster, 
shows that it's time for Activision to do a new Crash Bandicoot. And I agree wholeheartedly. Because this, for them, this is them milking and getting a new generation ready. You know, kind of where. That's what remasters are for. Not just about reusing things just for money. It's usually to drum up excitement and uh, get uh, new fans familiarized with the series. Um, you know, it's not. it doesn't always work and it doesn't always make sense. Like the God of War 3 remaster looked nothing like God of War. But I mean, it was just to get the name in people's heads again, I suppose. So that was a bit of a cash grab. You know, you gotta do what you gotta do. Make friends with a legion then, exactly. But I'd be so, I, I'm excited to look at that. I was looking at people giving out about the difficulty about CTR and that. Everyone seems to have the same issue. A lot of people that did, um, they do like one giant video of the whole campaign of games and stuff. They use the classic crash difficulty. But a lot of people have said that's harder, but I don't know. As far as I could tell, like I even tried a little bit on easy, not on stream, just on a, another profile. And I'm like, yeah, this is there's night and day. It doesn't just go from easy to medium. The the difficulty spike is unbelievable. When I went and played it on easy, I did a couple of races and I had already lapped everybody. To go from that in where medium, where you can barely touch the guy in front, it's mad. All right, let's go talk to Gen Genda. We'll try and get a little bit of uh, the simpler stuff of the starting of the case, so that when we play this next, we'll be kind of in the meat of it. Be nice to do a case by case, but they're, they're quite big. You know, you're talking about three, four hours of a case. I don't want to skip too many cutscenes or conversational stuff unless they're not talking. You know, then I'll just read it out. Club Sega. Yeah, I've had I got blood stain I think on Friday, so I've been, I was wanting to play it at the weekend, but it's just too hot. And it's been stupid shit kind of keeping me busy. It's all good. It's all good. I blame fucking Neo. I cannot seem to wow, really? finish that game or get any way stronger at all. <laughs> fucking trauma, man. Did he hit me or his friend? He didn't me. Over to the wall. I got something I want to show you. The back of my foot, motherfucker! Come on, bitch. Four. It's a home run! Stay down. Okay, nearly got squashed. Alright. Up we go. Gen I'm surprised he takes so much advice from Genda, this guy. I suppose that's why he calls him Genda Sensei. Oh, who's this dude? Well, look what the cat drank. You got a problem? Oops. Uh, no. We were just talking about you. Oh, really? Actually. Do you have a minute, oh, Yagami-san? Of course. Of course. Especially if you've got a job for me. <laughs> You're always so eager to work. A great fighter, too. You ever take lessons? I did back when I was a kid, yeah. The rest has been more of a learn by Hell yeah, I'm down with that. I like to think of it as comrade <laughs> style. Because you trained yourself on the streets? Man, what a life. I bet you've got some crazy stories. This one time, a cat um, beat the shit out of me. <laughs> Yagami -san. What's up? Actually, I do have oh, some work for you. Your name is what kind? Sauri? 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 Take a look at what I've got. S A O R I. Sorry, sorry. All right. Infidelity and for oh, look, I can do all these, can I? Cool. All the greens, very Irish. Uh, Noroko, Noroko Taguchi. Uh, Taguchi. Yeah, my name is okay. My husband is starting going out frequently recently. Okay. Reward eighty thousand yen. Got a nice bit of SP. So these are um, small side cases we can take. Oh look, main story progress. Reputation level forty or high? How do I do that? Where's my where's my reputation level? Okay, let's accept this little case. So basically, a cheating husband. You know, of course we're gonna have to do one of those. I'll send the details to your office. Put them up on your Thank board you. or something. Sounds good. Thanks, sorry, sorry. She's not sour at all. I promise. Where do I find my reputation? And probably in Kamura Go, is it? Uh, Playtime. Girlfriend zero four yet. Hold on, bitch. Fifty friends. God damn. Uh, city. I don't see anything about reputation. Reputation. See, so you're complete total. 2%. I'm playing this for five hours. Holy shit. Where's my reputation? Reputation. Maybe it's in cases? I don't see reputation anymore. Bronze rank. Maybe that's it? I don't know. Suffocation. I definitely get CTR, but when? I don't know. Yeah, it's really tough. I don't know what to, to say anymore. 
I keep telling myself, look, dude, this is tough. Don't rage. And I fucking rage. It fucking has me raging. And I'm better than that. Sorry, son. I'm telling you, she gets down on all sorts of shit. Can I talk to this guy? Alright, we got your case. Yagami. You still sniffing around? I don't really trust this case? guy. He might be senseless on, but never told Genji. I'm still looking for the mole, yeah. Yeah? That's not a problem, is it? Not a problem, per se. But the case is closed. I can't keep Yeah, we'll do it on the side. Fine by me. City reputation. It's is that what it is? Now. For Even real, so, then anyway? You're what? convinced Tamar is covering for the killer, right? You know he'll be none too happy if he finds out. I don't still care about case. Hamura. He brought this on himself. If this shit goes me. deep. Speaking of, have you seen him since the trial? I told you he's no, gonna be. He's gonna be an overarching character. Hamura. They're practically drinking buddies these days. That's why his character really? model looks fucking crazy. Come on in, Hatori-san. No, no, why are you guys Hattori. dealing with the fucking journalist? Oh, I know all about. This guy's such. He literally looks like a rat. He's a rat. Yagami-san. Oh, sorry. I forgot. Shintani had an interview today. Don't speak to the press. Shintori and Hattori, yeah. Shintani. Two of my favorite people in the world. Not. Just pretend Yagami isn't here, yeah? Wouldn't want your readers to I'll, 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 I'll have a look at that in a second. How the hell do you get your city oh, reputation? Oh, don't worry out? about that, Shintani-sensei. That courtroom was yours. And yours alone. Oh, God. Alone. Why don't you kneel over and uh, kiss his go. ring, Christ? I'm playing as Laurie and trying to make friends. Do it. Without a photo, Yagami-san, for as much as you did on the case, let me just get one of you in Shintani Sensei, huh? Come oh, on. So yeah, you can see where it's kind of oh, oh. What? Get him, Saori-san. That would be great, Shirosaki Sensei. Hiro Hirosaki Sensei, you see what I'm saying? It's all about. Uh, reputation so people you know like they call him um yagami san you know and then i think it's kun i think for a woman but it means different things right one like i said one means i like give it's a an old older person or a younger person or a woman or a man or a grandfather or as we call the other guy agenda sensei so because he was our our not a he didn't teach us kung fu he was mainly just our mentor our employer you know that kind of way it's crazy, right? You get that kind of stuff wrong and it can be very um embarrassing. Yeah, city reputation, you're right. The side case is fifty. But like how do you get it up? That's what that's what that's what she that's what she said. Wait, hold on, friend challenge. Affability. Alright. I've done some of these things already. Big eater love. Uh, okay. Let's turn to Yagami Detective Agency. Yes I would. That's our own, own home base. I like it. It's it's way more of a like um um a Japanese like simulator. You feel like you're this character in this world. You know what I mean? Because every other game, it's like you're the main character, like living out the story, and you can't really deviate from it. But this feels like more like we're gonna get girlfriends. We can go and have some food. We can go to the arcade and do some stuff. You know. There's more rumors over the weekend about GTA 6 and Bully 2. Sounds like um, the guys over at Rockstar have been watching the show Narcos a lot. Um, I, but every time I hear a little rumor pop up, it, it confirms exactly what I knew, which is uh, the, the very spoilery part in RDR 2, if you know what I'm saying. Um, you know what I'm talking about. It was done for a reason to bring it back up in GTA 6. I won't say anymore because Dynamite wants to play it. I love that the last guy always gets hit. Oh! Oh shit! I didn't want to waste that, but it's so good. What a waste. Well, what a waste! My god! Yagami san, you, we are definitely the same person. Um, Alright, is there a better way of like, boosting EX and stuff? Boost combo speed. Ooh, that would be cool. Increased attack damage. Nice. I don't know. Boost EX gauge. Mm, skill book. I need to find a skill book. Damn, that's gonna be tough. Balance of the tiger. That's like the default, or I assume that's what that's about. So a couple of things annoying me, like how he falls on the ground a little bit. So maybe that's what's up. 
That was by the one, there's one where you can, uh, I'll find it now. Do a move basically off the ground. ground. Well, knock down, there you go. Attacks enemies while getting back up from the ground. 300? Alright, let's play it. See if it works. Okay. So far though, I'm loving this. Like, there is a lot of, like, in-between cutscene stuff. But uh, I think that's just part of its appeal. And some of it, like, because it's, they do put the cutscenes like that in there, the conversations. You do... Is this his mom? We've got something in the mailbox! It's a freaking miracle! Excuse me. You hear about the job, ma'am? Hi. Oh, this is the woman. Yeah, this is her husband. Um, in you know, being unfaithful. I'm Yagami. Sorry to have kept you waiting. I'll get the door. I was actually going for the mailbox, but whatever. All right. So I'm a private investigator. Uh, you want me to investigate if your husband is cheating on you? Yeah. Uh, yes, I'm afraid that's right. I can't shake the feeling that he might be, but I need someone to find out for sure. Okay. So I case the darkest place. He's probably gambling or something. Very well. Can you tell me the whole story? Yes. You see, my husband and I own a cafe on Taihei Boulevard called Heavy Coffee. We've managed it together. Yeah, you know those heavy coffees where it runs right through you. So they're together ever since it opened. All right. My husband's a good man, but he's always kept to himself. We've been married 40 years. My God, how much has he kept to himself? And I hardly remember any real fights, let alone infidelity. Sounds like you two have a great marriage. I would usually agree, but lately he's been leaving the cafe early. I mean, there's always been slow days where he can leave to hit the pachinko slots or go see a movie, but lately this has become an almost everyday occurrence. What leads you believe he's cheating on you, though? Perhaps he simply found a new hobby, for instance. That's fairly common at your age, right? Yeah, I thought that might be the case at first, too, but one day I stopped in at the pachinko parlor he said he'd be at, I didn't see him anywhere. Dun, dun, dun. Are you sure you're at the right place? The city has quite a few pachinko parlors. I've only been once, might not be so sure. But I assure you, I've been through, I've checked in several times now. Alright, alright. Sound a bit fucking crazy. Sounds like you've done your homework. Sorry for giving you the third degree there. Yagami yeah, san, I'd like you to investigate where my husband goes when we leave the shop. And if he is cheating, can you tell me who he's meeting? You ready want the gory details? Got a bad feeling this is a goddamn tail mission, and I ain't down with those. I wonder what kind of a woman he would cheat on me with. I can do that, but I have to say, sometimes you're better off not knowing. They're old biddies, like, what the fuck is He's in there playing, like, Orgy Twister or something. Here. What the fuck is this? There's so many wrinkles, man, you can't tell if it's just a giant blob. Happen all people across the road, yeah. Yeah, please don't spot. I didn't, I promise. I, that makes sense, what the rumors I have heard. I still, I think they're gonna, they're shying away from a female lead, which I think is stupid of them. I don't want them to do it because of some bullshit false pandering to the feminist or anything. I just genuinely think it would be awesome, you know, it's about time. I am sick of um, fucking male protagonists and, and to the point of GTA 5, too many male protagonists. It, there was rumor one of them was supposed to be a woman that, at that point and I'd never checked out. I would have, GTA 5, I just would have went with Trevor. Would have been so much funnier the whole way through. But it was cool, it's just, it led to the other guys yeah, suffering. What I had heard originally was it was set in the 80s, in Dubai City, and it was going to be like someone like Mercedes or something you would control. I don't know. See, it's still a long, long way away. Like, you know, I'd say it would be a good chance that you might get Elder Scrolls 6 and GTA 6 in the same year. It'd be like Year of the Six, and then some other game will come out with a 6 in it, like Halo 6, right? Now, this is te infin Infinite, is technically Halo 6, but. It's the year of the devil. I want to play this fucking pinball machine, but it won't let me. Alright, so. Let me see. We have a side case and a main case and your mom's case. Let's fight. I wonder what Dynamite would look like as an anime character. Ooh. I'd say there's probably someone out there who already kind of looks like Dynamite anime form. I'd say he'd look like. He'd look like fucking someone from Dragon Ball Z. Probably the Grinch. No Grinch. No Grinch here. What does that do? Oh, now you show me the legend? There was no button to press legend. You bastards. Oh, there you go. Icon legend. I knew that. Shut the fuck up, mate. <laughs> the pink one's his girlfriend. Okay. Always in the pink. But I want to know what this means friend. Yeah. It's like you can become friends with every shopkeeper. All right, now let's get something out here. Someone sent me something. Please take your present. Newbie detective pack. Cool. What is that? How do I open my present? I want my fucking present, man. Items? 
Vince Martinia, Prudit Martins, Munim, Hog Bomb. What the fuck is a Hog Bomb? Experience a Hog in liquid form, made with all natural spring water. Mm. And bold testosterone. Oh dear God! What what is a hog in liquid form? I don't like to sound that. Let's say it's kind of warm and, and fuzzy. They put the belly button lint in it. Um, where's is it? This here? I think it is. Give me my fucking crazy. Decorate your room with items. Is that wheel? Select item. You have no items to place. God damn it! How do you... Where's the... What? Where's my present? You've got a present, but where is it? What? So maybe it was that hook bomb. I'll take your hook bomb. And we got this exquisite screw. Drone parts. Ah, shit. Such a cool game. Anything else we can do? Still don't know what was in my present. But we will find out. Jeez, that's a lot of levels for the city, right? Right, when we leave here, it's probably gonna start some shit. So I had found that QR poster thingy. You, you'll you see a little thing pop up for them. You know, like, like you're gonna talk to an NPC, but it's a poster. They are dotted around pretty well. What's this now? It's a fucking cat. Is it the same cat? This is the one. What? I just found it out of nowhere. Time to send him picture. It's a fucking cat. Picture sent. Weird, I just happened upon him. Hello? I think you found your Calico. I just sent you a text. Yep, that's the one. You've done very well, Yagami-san. I'm so glad he's safe. Oh, you had me so worried. Alright, that was the easiest mission ever. Thank God that someone put that there. <laughs> See, I told you, it'd be just fine. But there are two more that haven't been found. Huh? There's more? Yes, I'd like you to find the tabby next. I often see him in Little Asia. He ends up in some high, hard to reach spot. So he's a climber, huh? Yeah, I think. Alright. We on Pussy Patrol. Let's go find that other cat. Little Asia. I don't even know where Little Asia It's probably that. What's this? There's Little Asia. Your mom, Little Asia! Got him. Got him. That's fucked up. That's cool. I didn't know there was like a little GPS thingy. It's all about the GPS, isn't it? Got it. Oh, so it's kind of... It's nice and chill. I really like the combat. Isn't it crazy? And then Second City has the gunplay. This game actually crashed on me when I first played it. I think it was the heat because the PS4 fucked up, remember? It's kind of creepy. Um, You know... I hear, I hear a cat. Did I hear a cat just now? He really is way up there. Maybe it's the tabby. Oh no, I can't see much from down here. Better get. Oh, we can use the drone. All right. The drone needs some music, doesn't it? Casey nines that. Can we hit ourselves with the drone? Like flitter our face with the blades. People have lost like fingers and stuff. Especially those big drones like the Phantom. Jesus, man, Joseph. I see him. Ear kitty, kitty. I thought I thought a pudding cat. I did. I did. Hello. He's so cute. Oh my god. I'm gonna freaking die. Some cats are like. This is a pigeon. Jump onto the drone. Just take a nice photo. Say cheese, motherfucker. Some cats are like very good climbers, but forget how to Hello? get down. You're like stuck. I know. It's so cute. Alright, I sent you a text. I might as well find the last one. Then we'll call it for this thing. Might even help us level up. No, it's only friend requesting you. Alright, one more to go. Anyway, our last runaway critter is a black cat. He lives on Pink Street and he's fond of the ladies. Nice. Does the cat enjoy the pussy? How does that make no sense? That does not make sense. Alright, Pink Street. What? Why is this? What is this? Stop it. This is the pink street. How far does it go? It changes to... Oh, just pink street entrance. Okay. Cool, it's not that far away. I'm helping. Maybe this guy will help us with the actual cats and the investigations. But I mean, now that I know... It didn't take me long to figure it out, right? It's th Those cats... I know this is a separate cat mission. 
But those other cats. Uh, um, are only in the investigation stuff. As far as I know, they only give you like 5 SP. I don't. Unless it's in the stats around the city or something. Told money. Like, I don't see anything about cats. Enemies defeated 113 already. Damn. Drone race, race is one. It just says zero. Not out of how many. Maybe they'll add more shop city. But the cats seem to be semi important. Alright. He's a fan of the ladies. Maybe here? I think so. Oh, we got a fight. Bring it! Out of the way. I'm here to find some pussy. Looks like I found three pussies. It's hard to get the third move off, I've noticed. No matter what I press, it's like... Um, the guy wants to... That was awesome. The guy tries to break loose, you know, which is understandable. Take this time, post. Stop acting the fool. See what you're gonna do? Act the fool! Y'all gonna make me lose my mind up in here. It's so much cooler now, God. No, no noise. I'm such a happy little camper. Look at me. See? You gotta find happiness in the in the, the small things. And if that means no noisy PS4 in the room. A Fukie? Sorry, is that that's your name? I'm sorry. His name is Fukie. Well, fuck you! That's my name. Wait, right, maybe this woman saw a cat. Did you see a cat, missus? It's a black cat! And he's, he's found himself a woman. Damn. Damn. When the cat gets more action than you do. Wanda? There's a black cat over there. Where's the one he's looking for? Is there something I can help you with? Oh, are you just his owner? No, that's a stray, but I know the guy who takes care of him. Really? He's such a cute little fella. I was actually thinking of bringing him home with me. But if someone's looking for him, then I suppose I should leave him be. Uh, hold hold that off a moment. Let me contact to see if we can work something out. That'd be great if we get him a little forever home. When you adopt a cat or dog or animal of any kind, it's called their forever home. Are you able to find him? I think you should come and see for yourself. Maybe he'll get himself a girlfriend. The cat will get a family. <laughs> I, I love a happy ending. Alright. Wants to raise him on his own? Got it. If that's the case, then please don't let me stop you. I'm just glad this little guy found himself a good home and a good woman. Now, Mr. Cat, you have to provide for your woman. Alright? Don't become Yakuza Cat. <laughs> now, that would be cool! A Yakuza Cat game? It's kind of like that. There's a bit in uh, Hat in Time where um, kind of becomes like a little Yakuza girl. Alright. Take care of him. You really should have a soft spot for animals, huh? Especially the ones that can't fend for themselves. All those pampered pets at the pet shop are leaving for the other guys. After all, I'm a street cat myself. Excuse me. You wouldn't happen to run a blog called Nekomia Maya's Nekomia Nekomia's Lose Letter, would you? If you know about my blog, then does that mean you're one of my subscribers? Oh shit! It's getting meta in here, boys. I knew it is you. And yes, I've been subscribed to you for a long time. You could even say I'm one of your biggest fans. Oh damn! Wow, I'm flabbergasted. You're the first person I've met who actually reads my stuff. The dude's homeless, but he's got a blog. Shit. Shit. You gotta remind me of a cat yourself. He does. He's got these weird cat eyes, right? I'm sort of, I'm into that sort of thing. Oh, damn. Careful now. You should never get with one of your fans. She could turn into a weird killer. Would you like to grab some tea with me? It doesn't have to be now, but... Oh, shit. We're matchmaking in heaven. Two cat-loving crazy coons. And they're gonna go and become cat friends together. It's a date. Watch now, you're gonna find out that these two dress up like cats and get into some weird kind of furry shit. I'm telling you, I can smell it from here. Ah, oh, that's nice. Here's a treat. Whoa! He gave me some money. And he got himself a date. And the cat found a home. What a lovely happy ending. Don't go chasing her away, Echo me a song. Because the kitten's yours to keep. Wow, that ain't cheesy at all. City reputation, hell yes. God bless. I'm just happy the cat found a new home because after he murdered that other family in cold blood, I never thought he'd love again. I'm um, sorry, what? Rewind back then? Oh, the cat finds a, a, a lovely new family. No, no, after that. The bit about the murder in cold blood. Ah, you, you know how cats be. You don't feed them on time and you wake up at four in the morning and they're standing there with a sharpened claw over your neck. Good times! I swear I dreamed that. No, that was a murderous cat. This is my bike. It's a family heirloom. Yes, it is. If 
family heirloom into your face. Get up so I may dare smack that crap out of you. I like when he slides around the place. He's a badass. What a badass! Cyber probably has a cat outfit in his closet. Not right now. Upgrading abilities. Not right now. So I want to get some... F maybe this. Hi How's it going, lads? I'm here for the poon tang. Alright, maybe we can buy some stuff. Welcome. Would you like to learn about our music fair today? Alice Eno. Okay. Friend event. So, so much to do. Okay, with every 700 yen purchase you make, you will earn one point. Once you get 10 points, that's 7,000 yen, we'll present you with a shiny new record. Ooh, I want a record. On top of that, each branch carries a different record. So be sure to check us all over Camarocho. And now let's get this music fair up. A poppin'. So everything I buy at Popo counts towards a prize. It's not a bad deal. Alright, and, and can I keep this with me? I don't have to eat this right now. Can I have this? Why does she look like she farted? God damn. Boom. Sushi sass. Boom. Tuna onigiri. Mm. Maximum capacity. Okay. Let's get some oden. I've heard of oden noodles, right? Right? What's this? Fresh lettuce sandwich. All it's got is lettuce in it. That's it. It's got a fucking sandwich, maybe some butter, and just lettuce. You, you know when you got nothing in the fridge, you're like, fuck it, I'ma have a ketchup sandwich. I get I get my little slice of bread and I cut it into triangles because that's fancy shit. Then I get the, the ketchup and I spread it real slow. Oh shit. And then I eat it. It's just a ketchup sandwich. But I'm always hungry afterwards. Next we got some steamed buns. Get my, oh, taste bun? Pizza bun? It's pizza time. I'ma take some of that. Pocket tissue. Fuck it. We might need some pocket tissue. Um, Japanese style kumbo soup stuff. <laughs> but it's cat food. Garnished with dry sardines. Mmm. Beautiful. What the fuck do I want cat food for? Cats just love this chicken cooked to perfection and sliced into bite sized flakes. Shit, I've been hungry but never cat food hungry. Are you crazy? But I got myself a pizza bun. That looks fucking lovely. It's like a pizza baguette or something. Mmm. Shit. Fuck me up, pizza bun. There's more stuff down here. Ah, oh. women be shopping. I be shopping too. Sake. Jack Daniels. And it's only twenty. It's only twenty-five hundred yen. That's like two dollars. Is it? How much? Let's go. Let's go yen to euro. Yen to euro. That sounds like um, a porno. Uh, these are the days of our life. All right. Twenty-two fifty. Twenty-five. Oh shit! Hold on. That's equivalent. It's twenty euro. How much? You, well, that's not bad, man. And we got some Rokuyo Rokuyo barley tea. Mm. Do, is, do they have any of um? Oh, let me see. I've been watching enough Japanese stuff lately. Do you know that the only um banana vending machine, a vending machine that sells fresh bananas, the only the only banana vending machine is in Japan. It's a real thing. Fresh bananas. You just press that button and you get yourself a nice banana. No banana juice. No banana nothing. It's just a vending machine that sells banana. It's in Shibuya. It's a real thing. You get yourself a nice bunch of bananas. You open that package up and you just fucking have at it, man. Six bananas. Um, we got some soda. Fuck that shit. Cider. Mitsuya. I do like... You got some super dry. You got some beer. There's the hug bomb. Oh my god, it's worth ten grand. Can I sell that? Seven stars. That There's cigarettes. I remember them, right? Yeah, Yagami's favorite band of cigarettes. I remember seven star cigarette was in something else. Might have been another... Might have been... Let's get some fucking sake. Let's do it. I don't mind Jack Daniels. I mean, if nothing else in the house is not known with a bit of Jack Daniels. It's actually fine. I, I have Jack and Coke a good bit, actually, a good bit. It's fine. It's no Hennessy, but, you know, one's, one's fucking cognac and the other's whiskey. Do... Do they come in? An energy drink that blows your ass. Oh, shit! With 12 types of energizing ingredients and mouse piss. I love it. I only buy it for the mouse piss. Doji Kamin. Because your ass deserves to be blown out. Let's buy some of that, man. It's energy drinks. I'm buying everything. This, this girl's like, I'm out of stock. Tuna and egg? That's kind of weird. Tuna and egg. Shit, I might try that. Man, I'm getting hungry over here. Okay, let's buy everything. They all just came to... They all just came to $18. Thank you. Give me that point. Thanks for stopping by. With the purchase you've made today, your point total has gone up by two. 
Hell yes! Man, look at all this. Oh my god. Currently, you have two points. I thought we were finished talking. Arigato! Arigato, go my I can never say that properly. Can I look? I want to take a. This food is fucking nice, man. I like it. They have 7 Elevens in Japan. We don't even have 7 Elevens here. Look at that! Man, we got pork buns. I think that's a bit of squid. A bit of spud. That's, that's nice. Oh, popping chicken. Some prawn. Prawns, maybe? I don't know. Good. We got so much food here. Who are you? I'm gonna zoom in very pervy like right now. Did you fart? That, that's the smile of someone holding back a fart. I keep holding back the farts. You keep doing that, you're gonna explode. It keeps vibrating. Is there something in here? Staff room? ATM? I never understood ATM. At the minute. What does that mean? At, what's at the minute? English confuses me. I'm gonna take a selfie with this woman without her knowing. We call this stuff illegal. Wait, is the door like closed and open? Just like a real automatic door? Wow. If this was Buzz Lightyear, he'd spend 45 minutes trying to open this door. Cyber has some celery looking arms. Wait, me? Right now? I have celery arms? Damn. What if Firelit had broccoli toes? Broccoli toes! Broccoli no one knows! I've seen people with some weird thumbs, man. Alright, so is this in my items? Like, I think you can use some. See, there you go. Odin. Damn, that looks good. We got the pizza bun. Jesus. The, the bun itself looks really un undercooked, but I think that's the whole idea of it. It's meant to be more like, you know, like big ass bread. It's just straight up dumpling, right? And then we got sake. Sake to me. My energy drink. What did they do? Just give you health back, recovery items. I can use them in battle. It's really cool. So you don't always have to eat. It's like, stop the fight. I gotta eat, motherfucker. Let's go down to the subway. Oh, it won't let me. Oh shit, this guy wants to fight. He wants to steal my pizza bun. You can't have my pizza bun! Oh, Sada. These are my pizza buns! Oh, fuck my pizza. Who had the last pizza bun? It was me. We're having this Mortal Kombat over pizza buns. How could you, sir? We could have been friends. We could have shared this pizza bun. Now you ain't getting shit. You ain't getting shit! My pizza bun! That's what you get. Stay down, bitch. My pizza bun. Now I'm gonna eat it in front of your ass. I'm gonna do it. I draw. I can draw cyber in a food team. I. Oh wow. Half human, half food. Jesus. That when you start to get real hungry. I got over six thousand points, dude. Nice. Is that equate to like six euro? What a badass game. All right. I'm going to move over and play some Bloodstained, which is uh, the brand new uh, game from the original creator of Castlevania. You might have heard the word Metroidvania a lot, but that stemmed from the game Metroid and Castlevania. Um, yeah, looks beautiful. The music's beautiful. I've watched only play some of it. My physical copy did not come to like Friday, which is sickening. Um, I end up canceling it and getting it from somewhere else. Fuck him. So I'm going to switch over to that. I'm going to have to end the stream though because uh, it's on Xbox and stuff. So I'll be back in like five minutes. I might just run and grab a little bite too. I'll be back in about five. But thank you guys. This has been fun. I love this game. I'm going to try and do more of this in Sinking City as we go. Like I said, this week we should have it uh, all going well. We should have um, that Stranger Things game and Sea of Solitude on Friday. So yeah. Yes, yes, yes. But I wanted to start uh, Bloodstained so very much. So very much. Alright, I'll be back in five minutes, guys. Cheers! Have a good one.